on a whole different vibrating field. We were inside a whole different vibration. We, our responsibility in this time is not to participate in the fear mongering, but rather to channel the spirit in the Orisha Ogun, uh, which is that energy that governs lack of fear and courage. As African people, it's not for us. These is called prosopal metamorphosia, which really is to say that if you look at their faces and see them because your third eye will be opened after this eclipse, disease that they just came up with two weeks ago. Well, less than a week ago, less than two weeks ago, just a little bit over a week ago, publishing The Lancet and everything. So they are very much, very well prepared for what is about to unfold on the other side of the eclipse, because this is the age of enlightenment. And because they are, have the power and the authority to publish through their journals and to saturate through the media, they think <laughs> that they're one step ahead of us. Ritual need for freedom and liberation that the African has. And they called it dreptomania. Because if you try, if you, if you wanted freedom, a child of freedom, a liberator, if you tried to liberate yourself and your family and your people from their chattel slavery, that they are preparing ourselves, themselves, from our intuition and our ability to see by going out ahead of this to say those of us who are seeing them and will see them are suffering from a neurological disorder and a psychological psychiatric disease called prosopal metamorphosia. You hold a sec there. It was in 1803, adjacent to one another with a narrow overlap in a central uh, Illinois. Then the locusts start descending <laughs> right after the eclipse. And of course, CERN is firing up the Large Hadron uh, Collider uh, on April 8 to blast some particle or the other inside of that LHC that um, CERN is really trying to open a portal. That's basically what the school of thought is. And I don't know if CERN is really saying that they're not trying to open a portal because really and truly, if you list, if you read what they are trying to do, ultimately that's what it comes down to uh, for, for time travel or, or, or for whatever. And uh, they, in a way, they have already achieved that. Remember, if you if you look at the some of the results coming out um, in terms of not not human beings, but particles or whatever it is, you know, atoms or whatever it is that they're blasting. So, in any case, um, it, it, so this is concerning that they're doing this, you know, at the time of the eclipse. I'm not sure why they're doing this at the time of the eclipse, but it's them same one. <laughs> It's them same one that we're seeing. So NASA decided to shoot in the dark. Let's, for argument's sake, make we lap with fact like a bit on top of this. If CERN is trying to open a portal, the portal can work two ways, right? I mean, may I say, if you know, becoming a depa, no conspiracy theory. I am concerned about CERN. It is true, concerned about everything that's happening there, what I'm up to, and all of that. So we can have that scientific conversation another time, but we're not having no scientific conversation this morning. This morning is just, we just attack, right? So let us say for argument's sake, 
CERN really and truly is trying to open a portal. And, and at the time of the eclipse, let us say that they managed to do that because you have a comet to come, you have um, the tree body problem, which them see as a problem. So they might open that, right? So they're trying to open a, a, a portal at the time. The eclipse itself, you know, is it's a phenomenon. Uh, um, this is, this is uh, I know they've tried to explain all of these things, but if, if you take all of them explanations, um, no matter what he call himself, whether Einstein or otherwise, um, they really can't explain a whole lot of things, which we are people have already explained. I mean, the Dogons, the Dogons have already come and we have already come. And, you know, so, so there are portals everywhere. <laughs> and, <laughs> uh, right. So anyway, if you're going to factor in the Dogons and you have to cut, you have to walk with me. If we are going to talk about the Dogons, we're going to have, we're going to have to have some serious conversations. So, so, so let us say CERN is trying to open this portal on the one hand. And then on the other hand, NASA is ready with four rockets. This is interesting, you know, so CERN are opening the portal. Who are come, we don't know, or what are come, and they said this is just for argument's sake. Please don't go tell nobody, so my sister, right? We just thought this thing through. So while CERN opening the portal, NASA set with four rocket. These two things are connected, you know. These two things are the four rocket that NASA intend to shoot up somewhere that they say they're going to shoot into the eclipse. And the fact that CERN at the same time is firing up the LHC. You understand what I mean? Just really. And with four rockets. Well, there you go. So that's one thing. <laughs> and then there's and then there's another, right? A whole lot of things that I was going to talk about them. And I'm gonna open the phone lines in just a little while to get your take on all that's happening. And remember now, we're children of the sun, we are the solar eclipse, we are who we are, African people, we know ourselves, we understand vibrations and energies and frequency, we understand where we're from too, because we have through our DNA and, and our genetic memory, we kind of remember where we come from and who we are. Lots of us are there already. So we're not worried about anything that's happening around us because we know we are the eclipse. We, we are who we are. But we're having the conversation because this this is the only thing that people are talking about right now. Okay? And in parts of England, I think, um, also parts in, in, within the Caribbean, uh, we'll be able to witness partial eclipse. And it depends on where you are too. Because even in Jamaica, uh, if you're Montego Bay, I think you'll be seeing more. If you're in the West, you'll be seeing more. This is my reading of it. And um, so there are some places in Jamaica where you'll be seeing more of a partial eclipse. And it's going to be around about minutes to one o'clock tomorrow uh, in the afternoon. Uh, so, so yes, we'll be able to see a partial eclipse, not total eclipse, even though this is a great North American um, total eclipse that's going to be happening tomorrow. So it's going across Mexico, America. Um, it, 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 the path also extends to Canada and uh, some places in Europe, like Ireland, I'm told, and, and places in England and so on. So um, there are some areas where they, you'll be able to see it across the world. Um, I heard somebody ask a very interesting question this morning, last night. And that question was, um, it was a man from Australia. <laughs> he was saying, but if we have one sun, if we have one sun and there's going to be an eclipse, how come the whole world not seeing it? <laughs> All right, I'm sure the scientists are going to call us and tell us why. But, um, right, we told you about the circumstances required for a total solar eclipse, though. The sun, the moon, and the earth line up in that order. And uh, only a narrow band of uh, the earth actually experienced the phenomenon of totality during this eclipse. Um, and it relies on the unique relationship between the Earth and our moon. Uh, so the moon is really casting a shadow. Uh, prominent. Rastafari, give thanks. Give thanks. Give thanks. Give thanks. You tell me. 
Eh? Sierra Liquid, now you're Sierra Liquid Jai, of course. Yes. And America, and England, and China, and the whole of them, we hear them as the Maga Moon. I know them. <laughs> so, what you say? I know the Maga Moon, because we know them, they can't get some carry bone them up. The Maga Moon, so what you say? So, 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 and then they are ready. <laughs> well, look, I don't know. They know. They, I don't know. <laughs> I don't, don't know. Yes. What they, yeah, they, yes. But they have the they are moon, so they should not feel like we are I look at it as they are not far with them when they are shoot up Sydney. Yes. They are moon already. What the hell am I shoot up? I'm not doing. You know, she does something funny. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you have to be careful. Just say that you are talking about me. Me can talk about what I'm doing. Well, thank. So we now have to up our head. Just look how yeah. we are. Yes. And anything where we see a manifest now, we know say uh, that it go on already, you know? Yeah, man. So that. But another little subject, if I want to before, I go away quickly. Mm-hmm. You know, see, Canada, I said, how much team soldier done ya? It's like soldier done, I said, I go train in puppet, them puppet government, carry come to go to Haiti. Yes, and Haiti is saying we do not want a further militarization. We don't want an army. We don't want a police. Leave us alone so we can take care of ourselves. The thing, what, what leave us alone mean also, now, because you see all of those so-called gang warfare, they are, they are fueled by the external interference in Haiti. So if you leave Haiti alone, take your gangs out, take your guns out, and, and, and these people who liberate themselves. Um, can do it again, you know. But yeah, so so so, so, Jama- so Jamaica, all um, Jamaica is all up in all of this. That my thing is follow the money. A lot of them. Jamaica is a democracy. We must never forget this. Jamaica is a democracy, constitutional monarchy, a system of government run by England, Charles, and his colleagues. Then, so you must never forget this. That's you know? true. But then you know, so, today is April. Today is April seven. We always support America, you know. Yes, today is April 7. Mm, they are always support America. So any black people in the world, you know, we are all over the country with a black population and say, they are always support America. Yeah. It's a puppet, you know? Yeah. Give thanks, my puppet. brother. Yeah, it's a puppet. Freedom, Give redemption, thanks. international repatriation, all black sons and daughters must return home to Africa, you know? With a virus, lightning, thunder, famine and pestilence. Uh, we are going to speak Jamaica in a treaty, state, yeah, I am, that I am. Holy Manuel, I, Celestia, I, Ja, Rastafari. Give thanks, my brother, give thanks. So while we're looking up, greetings, my brother, how are you doing? Very happy, as long as I get up 6 o'clock Sunday morning, I'm really happy. <laughs> give thanks, give thanks. Okay, question, Carba, mm-hmm. relax, eh? The boss couple mm-hmm. last Wednesday ago, but I actually had a woman with a high IQ. <laughs> There's a video going around with the 10 most polit- uh, politicians 39 million US, 49 million US. The, t- the, 10 most, the, the, ten, the 10 most what? The 10 most richest politicians. Where? In Jamaica? In Jamaica? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The man from me used to go on like him in the same brother, the one Petro Jam. Mm-hmm. The one who won all the land, my center, my son, I want to know what was this. Well, let, 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 me, let, me, let, me, let me check you with you a minute. There's a video going around. Um, who produced that video? Well, you look at the same side. I uh, wasn't taking no to our producers. But but it, but, but, so, so it, it, it's very important. I think that's the most important thing of all. Because... Anybody can put out a video. What first we want to know, what's the research? Where did the information come from? Who produced the video? Where did you get these numbers? Are these numbers credible? Or did you just put out a video um exactly, but, on, yeah. on, 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 on something that somebody else said or on information that is not necessarily true? That these these are the questions that we have to ask when we see videos going along with anything about ten most riches or ten this or ten that or whatever. 
That's true, Carver. Yeah. That's true, but if somebody accused me, I say, mm-hmm. P, mm-hmm. they find out 10 million US. I would have to go to the police and declare myself, say no. So you're saying that they were accused in the video of being the racist? No, they just, is that them do a survey and I don't know which kind of a source, but they came up with it. But I probably can't send the video to I yeah, I, for me, I will. Uh, to, uh, the video means nothing unless I can see where the information came from. Where did you get this information? Is this information credible? Outside of that, the video is nonsense. Yes, and I'm not yes, saying yes, that it's nonsense, you know. Yes, yes, I'm saying yes, yes. that until I can verify the facts or the information in the video, it's just another video. All right, I have a WhatsApp number, I can send the video. Mm. I can also search for it. Which, which, which where, where is it on TikTok? TikTok, I think. Yeah. yeah, I can, I can, I can search for it. But um, so, so you never so check for see, you never check for see if it's credible. No, I can't go back and look at the video. Um, but the question I want to ask mm. to Carbo. Yeah. So, in 1962, Jamaican people been living in squalor, and we know of these guys. Not the rich because there's a particular one who wanna lock a land up my center bus. Mm-hmm. All these guys still to know that they're still calling Jamaican people squatter. Well Jamaican you know, well Jamaican people allow themselves to be called squatters. At some point Jamaican people will have to rise up. We don't have no choice against all of these. And especially today, April 7, like Chief Tachi rose up, because um as long as we allow this to happen. It will continue to happen. We expect politicians to have conscience. They have no conscience. Yeah, they no. have no empathy. These are the, what is residing in their in the form that they're carrying that look like human form. Might be some different kind of species. I, I, the, 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 there is no conscience, so we cannot appeal to the conscience of those who are conscious, conscienceless, who are not able to feel empathy. Or driven by greed, greed and power. I heard Mark Golden talk about if he, if, if we are fighting Prime Minister Jamaica, he will make Bob Marley a hero. The question I want to ask, Carl, mm-hmm. how is it that I don't hear Mark Golden talk about if I make Bob Marley a hero? We have so much wealth. How is it that Mark Golden not saying if he become a Prime Minister, which you can't trust them, he's going to. A quarter you can learn to farm three period. Well, I think I think Mark Golding, I think we need to pose that pose that question to Mark Golding. Sorry, what what me. plans do you have for 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 um for, for, for land for access to land and access to to to, to services and 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 so on? This is these are the questions we're supposed to ask Mark Golding, and and I think no, the no. demand and answer. Thank you, my brother. I do have to take a break, but thank you yeah, so much. Uh, All right. to thank you, my sister. Give thanks. So we need to find that house. Land will want to bad body. Exactly. Land. And Mother Comet has been going through space and time for a little while now, and I think it's coming, passing near to that whole eclipse just around tomorrow. And we have some, uh, these people setting up to do them things. Some people are set up to shoot some rocket in it. And some people are set up to split some atom and, and, and collide some atom and, and do what they do. And some people planning to open a portal and so on. And then when we see them, when they come, they say that we're mad. Let me go to the phone lines, 722. Uh, good morning, greetings. Good morning. Yes, how are you doing? I'm good. Yes. And you? I'm well, thank you. All right, big up, big yes. up. Cabo. Give thanks. Bless yes, up. Yeah. yeah, man. Just a yearly up still in our me, you know. Yes. What, you're, yeah. you're waiting for me. I don't know if you remember the voice, yeah. Remember the voice, man. Um, so, so what do you think this is for? Big keep tomorrow. Mm-hmm. You know what I say? Me not really. Not a penny. Me not really penny. Me not really a penny. <laughs> yeah, because, uh, yeah, because we stay. You know? I guess I guess these things is not nature yes. in its time a yes. manifest yes. It's mystic. Mm-hmm. You know, I just we have to just stumble ourselves and just give praises and understand nature and just yes. give a card in harmony with nature, you know. Exactly. 
me and say something with Chile. I'm a love enough. Big up Jerry Small. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Give thanks. I Big hear that we and this. Big up Dutty Jerry Small, my brother. <sighs> But no, you know, I call him Dutty, you know, Jerry, I'm a brother. I know, I know, I know. And we say, and we say, book man Dutty, so, yeah. Yeah, man, that's how we talk, man. Yeah. Big up. Yes, yeah. so, so. Big up. Yes, big up, Big up, Muta Baroka. Big up, Muta, mm -hmm. true. Um, you see, the thing is that we can't look for the devil if we do God work. Mm -hmm. The devil will do the devil works. Mm -hmm. True. And we have to know you have people that try to work for the devil. Exactly. So, we who know right, we have to do just get ourselves together in our own space, do what we do, and find yes. ways to unite. Because yes. unity is strength, you know, and yes. them unite and not do for them thing, you know. Yes. So all people are talking about godliness, make sure they educate themselves properly, you know, and especially the main things of life where we depend on, you know. And just a, a, lot, a, lot of those, a lot of those who speak the loudest um, uh, about um, godliness, th those who speak the loudest are usually people that you need to look at again. Yeah. Because we don't yeah. need, we don't need, you, you don't need to shout about godliness. You just need to be. Yeah, godliness is not really goodness, you know, logic. Right. So just, logical just, so thinking, just be. You know, critical thinking, logical reasoning, you know. Yes. You have to, kindness. Yeah, God is really goodness, you know, of the yeah. highest form, the purest form, you know. Empathy. Yeah. 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 And um, evil will hear good. True. You know, likewise, he is good, he is evil. And will shout good, and will shout good. Oh, no, evil, evil will also shout good, because evil is it's dressed. Doctor, and we have to fight it. The prophecies are for fully filled, and I read in the Bible. Bless up, Kabo. Give thanks, hear, you know, my brother. Give now. thanks, give thanks. Rastafari, the Almighty. You know, from the other week, we try to call what you mean to take a call. You mm. know what's happening in Haiti? It is said that history students in where? are not full history in Haiti. Oh, yes, yes. I'm saying it is mm. that, that history students in Jamaica and history practitioners are not buzzing with activity to research the genesis of what is happening in Haiti, how it has carried over until present day. A lot of people don't know what happened with Bertram Aristide and all of these things. But you, and but, it is really sad enough. But you know, remember, you know, we're always talking, I mean, you know, always that we have this conversation over time too. Um, we always talk about knowledge being funded because how knowledge is how knowledge is is um is created it, it's 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 sponsored and it is funded and so it, those, who, those who are paying for the creation of knowledge will ensure that their viewpoint and that you're seeing that the research is done through their lens so we're not getting mm -hmm. much better getting here unless we're able to create our knowing is everything I think, and you know, it's out of IT that the saying "history is my alibi," which is which, which I have said, it, it, it's specifically related to IT. You know, um, of what is what is the history, and sometimes we have to take history apart. I don't know if you heard me during the month of February, where I was just looking at a history from a political perspective of the, the politics and the power dynamics involved in the creation or the documentation or documenting of history and then what our responsibility is to revisit all of it and to rewrite it. But it's not gonna happen as long as it is the knowledge is the creation of knowledge is being funded by the oppressor, by the enslaver, by those who are still oppressing IT. But you and you know another thing in our problem is that it is not that the information is no longer there. Like you were saying it tonight, Mr. Dear, that it's not that the information is not there anymore. Mm -hmm. It is that they know that those who need to go for the information are not going for them. So they are not even concerned some of the information that are out there. I agree with you. Because I agree with you. There are multiple yes. sources out there for you to look at, but because it's a small amount of us that are actually going after the information. Because it the does. populace that needs it. They're not going up there and they know it, so they're not censoring it. Because, so. because the researchers and the universities and so on are looking at the bread and butter issues. They're talking about funding and, and sponsorship and exactly. monies and, and where these monies are coming from. And if you go down that road of truth, then how, you may as well just close your doors. Yeah. Thank you, my brother. Good to hear from you. You're, you're on the island or you're still over some? I'm still over some. Two little bit more things before. All right, hold on. Don't go. Um, oh, no, hold on, then I have to take a break. Hold on. All right. This is Running African, and what a Sunday we just um, the day before this uh, astronomical celestial event, ethereal twilight that we're waiting for. 
And uh, because of just so much out there about this and about so much more that's happening around us at this time, we've decided that this morning we become part of a listening audience and have you talk as the philosophers. So we're listening to the philosophers. So we're asking all the philosophers to call in, have a conversation. I'm willing to listen. Here we have a philosopher online, my brother Akim. Go ahead, Akim. <laughs> <laughs> so you um, had you had two 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 more points to make. Yeah, uh, just one and a half really. Yeah. Um, the scholar before mentioned about um, the issue of food security, which is very important, and Mark Gould is the intention. And, mm-hmm. You know, uh, just to make people you know that I'm a member of the Port of the team. Um, mm-hmm. From what I know, and this is something that we are, we are serious, and I, for whatever reason, I trust Mark Williams' judgment. And he has indicated maybe it needs to be broader, but he has indicated that looking to ensure that through the agriculture society of Jamaica, more is done for farmers in terms of access to. Uh, so some people know, right. uh, some people don't know. That, so how do you get this information to the... They have been meeting with, yeah. the, with the J.A., so maybe it needs to be a broader consultation, maybe with the rest of the group, just the same across the island and stuff, so, mm-hmm. in order for you to have a broader um, dispersing of information to the dining to what you're trying to, to sell, and also to get ideas from others to improve the policy that you're trying to implement. And mm-hmm. I, I trust that we may, we may form government because it look like some people are having a meltdown, but that's mm-hmm. not it for me this morning. Mm-hmm. Um, this week, I lost a friend a brother. Really? Where you going? Oh, we just lost you on the phone there. Uh, is it Akeem? My con- deepest condolences, my brother, to, to you and to the to the family. I don't know what happened, but the call seemed to have dropped. Um, looks like it's from your end, Akeem. So I know you'll always try and get us back if you can. I'm so sorry to hear, though, about your loss. You're inside of the Africa Forum. This is Running African. Taking your telephone calls this morning. Hey. Yes, how are you doing? How you do, Kabu? Kabu, I am, I, I am step, well if you step. two are well. <laughs> This is rising sun again, rising sun again. Yes, we're going rising. <laughs> yes, so yes. Love, yeah. love and joy will never end. Mm, give thanks, my love brother. Love and joy will never end. Yeah. So, yes. Yeah. Um, turn your, your radio off. Turn your radio off. The radio off? Yeah, because there's a, there's, a, there's a delay. Uh, is, is it still is it off? Yeah. All right, go ahead now. Yeah, can you hear yes. me? Mm-hmm. So we are touch a lot of things that are really, really, really important, really good. Uh, we know this evil great distractment. We know the great distractment we have great from mm-hmm. ever since. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. Because we see a lot of this area. You know, the, you know one of the biggest distractments we see as you do when I come up. Mm-hmm. Because we are in a rest for rest and for I will know. We know a lot of things that we get a lot of things. Yes. So, you see the first big distractment when they said 2000, when they said when God had come, when Jesus had come. How did you tell him? How did you tell him that? Tell with that? <laughs> yeah, I see, I see people that we are telling about the eclipse right now, and they were still hard, and I go to eat. And I talk about um, climate change. <laughs> Climate change. It's a, it's a, it's a distraction. Well, it's a them same one. What are they, what what are they doing while they are distracting us? Tell me, what, what, what is it that they are distracting us from? You know, sir. As far as I can see, is new ideas and new technology things they are put in place mm-hmm. within within the distraction. So mm-hmm. by the time you realize the distraction, by the time you didn't realize the distraction, the distraction already in place already. Yes. Yes. yes, so totally, yes. so totally is like we have to focus on the real things where we know we're supposed to focus as a nation. Yeah. And I remember we had COVID too, you know, COVID, two years of lockdown. Yeah. Two, two years of <laughs> you locked down the world. Listen, if you can get away, I, 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 if you can get away with locking down the entire world for two years, that is some serious power, you know. 
And you see, 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 the lot of yeah, yeah, the price change, everything change, everything new technology change. put in place. Everything yes, change. Yes. Watch this again now. You see, you see, when you remember when I had the table, you, you, you know that even the war we do it Russia and Ukraine right now is a big distraction, it's a big distraction too. Of them land, them land, them land, them attack in Africa, Africa, yes. Uh, Africa. Yes. And and more, obviously, and more because they are they're about to go to war also. They wanted to use this war that them fabricate between NATO against Russia. Obviously, and it's an interesting thing because Russia has won that war and uh, uh, with the help of China. So that war is, is long over and done. One, this war has been won by, by Russia. It was supposed to usher in a nuclear situation because they kept provoking Russia to launch nuclear weapons. Now they have gone on to Iran so the provocation now is against Iran. And that is why Israel bombed the embassy in Syria. And you hear America saying that they are on standby for attack from Iran. And then you have a Bush, uh, you have a um, uh, Biden meeting with, with, Biden. with the Ayatollah and uh, coming out and saying that, well, um, you know, Iran has promised that they're not going to attack anything. But we see Israel at the same time where people are. Uh, being told to go into bunkers and to, uh, to 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 go away from Tel Aviv and all kinds of stories because Iran after them provoke Iran because Iran is going to attack. This is this is ridiculous. Now at the same time, there are a hundred thousand people took to the streets in Israel yesterday to protest against Netanyahu against his his, his genocide in 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 um in Gaza. The Western media is not reporting on that, but thank God that there's a lot of people there who are sending those out. So there's a lot, there are a lot, it's smoke and mirrors, lots of distractions while they do what they're doing. But part of this, I think, is to move into the next phase, which is a phase of nuclear war. And it is a wounded eagle that is leading this because it senses that it is about to die. You know where you know where the eagle for do the eagle. You there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm here. I'm yes, here. Yes, I'm yes. Yeah, you, you're saying the, the eagle should. Right now, the eagle, the eagle, right now should go and reconsider because right now them crumbling, them crumbling. You know, them should go and reconsider because there's no way, there's no way history show we say. You understand? They might go rain, they might go rain forever. The history never shows that they might go rain forever. Because that, that, a lot of people... It's already over. The rain is already over. over. Yes, over. it's already over. over. Yeah. So, so, look into it again, Kabo. You see? Where the, where the African leaders them are right now, they need to take real, 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 real stands and real, real more, some more tangible yes. measurement towards certain things, towards France. Don't you... All right. So, it's... I'm very happy to see what's happening in Senegal with this 44-year-old um, yes. who has won the yes. election. Yes. Um, Jume Faye, who has won the elections and has said to France, go and get your own independence and come off of the backs of Africa. Stop sucking the blood of you, Africa like blood. You, you've been, blood, you, you've blood been a big baby too much. You've, you've been, been a big baby too much. How long you've been sucking Africa breast? Yes. Or, go on and go on and be independent. Go yeah. on, go on, and be yes. independent. And we, see, and we see, and we see, we see, um, Mali, Burkina Faso, and so on. We see them reaching out to Senegal, and these are all young people, well, mainly young people, um, well, younger than the usual that we've, we've seen come out. And I hope that that catches on across the continent of Africa. Obviously, it is going to take time, but we like what we see happening so far. Yes. There have been, I will hope. yes, go ahead. I will hope I'm period as them don't take no bribe, them don't take no bribe. Don't take no farm of bribery, no way, no time. Yes. You understand? Because yes. we can do it. We can do it. Yes. We're not going to try. We are going to do it. Yes. It's not like our poor parents were trying things. No, we're mm -hmm. going to do things this time. I show mm -hmm. them to listen. We can do it. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because all of them, over the many moons and many suns, yes. you understand? They've been depending, up, depending upon us. You understand? And now is the time when we say, right, we're going to take our stand now and do what we're supposed to do for ourselves. Yes. You understand? Yes. Deal with our people first. 
You understand? And any one of them where they say they want to come in, come take no part. You understand? The only part them can take is for them to go back to their people and tell freedom people what we're dealing with and how we want our things to run and, yes. what, and what, we are, what, what we're looking for and what yes. we are defending. Exactly. Yes. Any, exactly. Help want, any, help, that's any help we want from them. We have, see, because we know we yes. know of the infiltrators. Mm -hmm. We don't want no more infiltrators. And many, and many times we get bring down to infiltrators. True. Uh, this has been Africa's problem. Um, let us see where we go from here. They are forging relationships with others, and I think they have really little choice but to forge relationships with BRICS and with um, uh, with the South and so on. So, so let us see what happens. Let us see what happens. Uh, we're, we're, we're rooting for Africa. You know, uh, it can only get better. I don't see how this can get worse. Um, we have to keep the colonizers out. They're going to have to start doing that in West Africa because there is its appearances to the mind with a semblance of independence in West Africa. But we understand the extent to which Africom, under the the, militari the militarization of aid and just the militarization of Africa totally, which was escalated on the back of Obama. That was the greatest deception of all that he escalated the mil militarization of Africa and African leaders have been fooled by another, another one of them in black skin who went to Africa <laughs> and literally fooled them. So here we All are right. dealing with these issues. But I think, I think that we are on yeah. point to, to, to free ourselves and to liberate ourselves. Yes, my brother. Kabu, kabu, mm. kabu, kabu. Yes, my brother. We have, we have about two more, two more, two more things. Yes. You hear me chat about uh, our, somebody like our own bring up, bring up such a such like that? You remember, you, do you remember the speech of Eilis Selassie? Mm -hmm. Do you remember the speech of Eilis Selassie? At the UN? I mean, the speech Eilis. of Eilis Selassie. Which one? Which speech? When she dead to black and white oppressors. Ah, uh, well, you see, uh, um, it, it, this is this is interesting because I didn't know that came di directly from His Majesty because I've heard that in in you know be, being spoken, but I didn't know it came directly uh, yes. from him. But um, <laughs> but but it it is. You see, there's there's. <laughs> we we'll talk about that another time in terms of. Yeah, I mean, we know, yes. know a lot of people. We know a lot of people are gonna run from it. A lot of people are gonna run from it. It's not me saying we just born what the, I just born what the, you know. I don't I think that. I don't think that any of us should run from it. I think it is what it is. We have to understand that. Thank people, you. That then right now, then, yeah. then listen right now. We're, we're under right now, Al Kabu. We're under the under the oppressors and downpressers right now. Yes, and a lot of them are in black skins. A lot of them are wearing black skins, but we know there's a different spirit inside of them because we understand that level there. So, so this is what we this is what we are faced right now. The hands of the oppressors and those who go join up with the oppressors are oppressed. We see them we exactly. Are we. So it's not just right now, no, right now, right, right now, on this is, island. Right now, right now, look into it. And, and the plane, the plane, the plane, the plane. As daylight. Plane, plane. Them just trying to put the oppressors because we yes. know who is the oppressors. But this and is them trying to put the oppressors. That's why that's why his majesty I said they never partial in the days in the judgment, there's no partiality. Judgment and justice shall execute. You know, there can't be any because it's I think serious, I think for serious. us I think for us we are in the, the final stages of liberating ourselves. It is no or never. And that process to start is start first of all by us seeing them and understanding who they are because many have been Remember. fooled many have been fooled for a long time but the dog, is, the dog they're excited out the door they're not eat, they're not eat for money no i want i'll be glad when you ask about the dog then Gabu. Mm -hmm. be glad about your ass. well you know first of all first and foremost, you know more more mm -hmm. people from um the virgin do i clock Mm -hmm. No, I mean, do I do I praise her? Do I praise her? Sorry. <laughs> yes, yes. Do right. I praise her? Do I praise her? Think of Musa and all the hygiene they mean at the same time. And and you maximum respect every time. You know that this month, next month is your uh, your earth song. Yes. <laughs> next month, next month is your earth song. Yeah, I've heard it. Yes. This is real. Remember, I'm here. I'm here. Remember, we come on for the program. I ask you about Doctor Sidney Miguel. And Dr. Clark, that, that, man. Yes, yes. Dr. Cinema Girl. Yeah, man. Um, I know yes, you're Dr. Clark. Listen, Kabu, I know you're, 
And I used to do that today. We are looking at, we are listening to everything else. I know, Remember, I, know. I know. Remember the chief, chief, tell us if you can't go be in that trouble, you know. <laughs> I don't care what we're doing in that trouble. Hey, 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 that is our own damn business. Say that again. You know what we're thinking? That is our own damn business. In other words, we're not going to talk about everything yeah, yeah, we're thinking. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, because it's not what we know is not what you are taught us. All right. What we know is not what we are taught us. And we are what we are. We are what we are, and that's the way it's, it's going to be. be. Yes, my you brother. Can. Yes, so we are saying, so Kabu, <laughs> yes. we are telling you, say, you see the dog where you talk about your area about there? Mm -hmm. It's a dog where you eat, like, eat a sweet pepper, tomato, carrot, cabbage. A vegetarian? Pumpkin. Yes. <laughs> Susumba. <laughs> we are telling you, I have jackfruit, jackfruit, sour sap. <laughs> hey, you say, Kabu, we are going to put it up, 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 she name, a Martin, she name, she name, Marty. What's your name? Marty, Miss Marty. Marty. Yeah, Miss Marty. Yes. Well, so what, <laughs> Miss Marty, what kind of dog is it? It's a woman dog. It's a woman dog. That's okay. Miss, Marty. Miss, Miss Marty. So um so she eats um sauce so up cabbage. Yes, she, she eats sauce so up, she eats pumpkin. She eats okay. she eats veg, she eats cucumber, lettuce, she eats cucumber. Uh -huh. She eats, she loves sweet pepper, she loves sweet pepper, she loves sweet pepper. Are you serious? She loves tomato, she eats tomato too. She loves tomato. Are you serious? Yeah, and coconut, anywhere me the anywhere them they can use the machine and lick yes, up coconut yes, and have yes. to block it. Them are run come. Yeah, I mean, maybe I coconut. realize the dogs love coconut, you know. And yes, I mean yes, no, I mean yes, I mean no coconut. because my dog eat eat it's so up to you know. But um yes, yes, yes. it's all up. And they love I, and they love ripe banana. They, she love ripe banana. Uh, Yo, ripe uh, orange, Mr. Gabo, orange and uh, tangerine. She love orange and tangerine. She love orange and tangerine. Hold on, let me ask you let me ask let me ask you a question. Where you get tangerine from? I have tangerine tree where I have I'm a I'm a I'm a woman live man. Which parish you live in, huh? Huh? I think I got to the same time to you, sir. Well, I mean, yeah, man, I took a little nice, yeah, relaxing place in a yeah. time where cool and refreshing. And we have everything up there where, where, where we can use and take care yes. of our booty to a, to a certain level. So, you know, I'm not a tangerine sucker. Yeah, we just plant out two of the air, just plant yeah. out two of the air. But yes. we can line up now. But you know what? We have Kneesbury, so come here, break me. We have Kneesbury. We have Kneesbury. But what would I take one of the breadfruit sucker for you? I'm going to take a yeah, tangerine, I'm gonna take a tangerine yeah. sucker. But I have a range of the stand. I have tangerine seed on me. I must have to keep them and mm -hmm. to set them. That's me. You know, so we can replant. Then if any right. hurricane comes, we still have young one to come. Right, we right, try right. to be going. We have, we have young one to recome, said we, you know? Right, right. So, yeah, we can have yeah. a tangerine. That's a tangerine. Yes, ma'am. Make a range. Make a range. Make a range. So, mm -hmm. I, yeah. So, as we are saying, right now, mm -hmm. we, want, we want to know it right now. You see, majority of the artists them right now, we mm. want to be steady with the music where we really want to hear. We mm. can't hear the end because I must say, Alice Nassia is a chief musician, you know. Mm -hmm. Chief musician, and from the music, you hear, you hear the point where we are touched by the Kabu. Mm -hmm. Because all of these things just make sense. I mean, no, it's just going to come full circle. The earth, and the four wings that heard right now are listening to this program here. Yeah, it's my brother. You know it's, it is going to come full circle. I am not worried about. The thing you know, because if, if, if you can't sit down the road, this, this music is going to come full circle, it has to come forward, you know. The music has to come forward, and we already to, when you have somebody like a YG Marley who's out there, um, on 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 the spirit of his, of, his, of his grandfather and the spirit of his mother, um, Lauren Hill, I like that mm. because that has already broken into the spaces and into the minds of the Gen Z yes, and, yes. and and the and yes. the, and the um and the Gen Alphas. So so we so, so for me, I'm I am optimistic about where it's going. Um, I think that we we, we we we're going to be okay. I think we're going to be okay. I think so. I think we're going to be okay. Yeah, yeah because the thing is, is no. As I said, music is a info, is a, is a. 
As I say, mm. music is the information. Look, like, information. Look, I don't know the whole of your credit. Me go talk one next no, time. No, 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 right. Credit can't be taboo. No, but when me go give somebody, yeah. me go give somebody else a, a, a call. Yeah, all right then. Yes. Long live Africa, mm. long live the black man and woman and child. Yes, give thanks and, my brother. And yes. never heal up, never heal up two IG, never heal up two IG, never heal up an IG in a West Berlin named um, Jamaic, mm. and an IG in a Cockburn Penny named Jajin. I mean, I have a next to go in a, 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 a, in 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 a, day on the date of the, um, when Chief Teshi launched that liber struggle for, uh, for independence and the liberation war in St. Mary. Good day. We start we start we start Chief yes, yes, So, so yes, happy, so happy soul. I return to to your to to to, to the little one. Yes, it's your niece. Yeah, she she live she she named April. She named April. She, April. Lives, she lives in, in, in America. She lives in America yeah, with her yeah. mother uh, and stuff like that. But it's um, yeah. but it's a strength. It's a strength where we have so much. We have so much. We have so much to say. Our uh, taboo. So we, much things. Well, we, we, we so get a nice things. we we get a nice run and we we yes. we we'll do it again. Have, so. We just can't do. We can't do. We leave it open. We leave it yeah. open. We yeah. leave it open. Give thanks, my brother. Give so, thanks. Maximum respect, much love and respect. And to you, too. Africa, long live the black woman and child. Give thanks. Much love, Abkabu. Come on the eclipse, we ride the eclipse. We are the eclipse, we ride the comets. We come on the comets. <laughs> we are daughters and, and sons and children of the universe and of a son and so on. So this is our thing. We're, we're, it's it's one, and, one and the same. We're all, you know, everything is connected. And in that way, we understand our connection to the whole process for us. It's a time of enlightenment. It's a time um, to to de-stress of the entanglement. It's a time of uh, reflection. It's a time of just going meditation. And, and on the other side of that, a time of rebirth, renaissance, as we go back to the phone lines. Hello, Kola, good morning, greetings. Yeah, good morning, good morning, Carla. Hey, how are you doing? Yeah, blessed, blessed. Yes. Yeah, first of all, um, welcome back, Jerry from Africa, you know? Yes. Jerry Small, yeah. Welcome forward, Jerry. Yeah, man, yes. blessed. And big up, Mota. Give thanks. Greetings, Mota. Yeah, man. Yeah. So refreshing, you know. Me and Mota, um, the interview last night. Mm -hmm. uh, no, last night. Um, Wednesday night in the mm -hmm. program, yeah. You know, we show up the people, you know? Mm -hmm. So, a two sides to the story. You know, we are going a year to, you know, yes. Cause, you know, most people don't go um hear BBC and I hear some, you know, yes. CNN and them little thing there. Exactly. I don't know. Say it's a it's a revolution. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now year to. Yeah. And it continue. Yeah, it's a, see it. yeah. yeah. But as I say, we are going a year to. We are going see we are Jamaica. You know? True. It's only true the people are really rise up yet. Mm -hmm. You know? Oh, from, many, from, many, from many different angles, too. Because the same way that the private sector is arming the ex police officers to head up so called gangs in Haiti is the very same way that we have yeah. people with money and bringing in guns into this island to arm people whose only. Well, well it, it's, it's not even about revolution in that in, in that sense. It, 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 the sense of it is to turn up on each other. It it, yeah. it, it works for someone. When you see, I see another thing I go on with um, them. I do know where most of the ex police them are uh, security guard company and all them things. Mm -hmm. uh, and then mm -hmm. Felix Land the same way, and okay. you know. Is, is, is that yeah. thing will continue, you yes. know? Yes. And if you notice, you notice the, 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 the politics in Jamaica, you know? So them draft up a, um, so them draft up a, 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 a thing there where them say them a, um, do the constitution, reform, a ministry. Mm -hmm. And uh, no, not even one law, they don't legislate, they don't legislate from it. Mm -hmm. We're seeing taxpayers' money for, 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 for rent and everything. 
Mm-hmm. And uh, it continues. That, that, that process, I, I think, is ongoing. Isn't it? Can you hold us? Let, let me take a quick break. Yeah. Only optical L maker. We're going to be experiencing partial eclipse just minutes to about 12.51 or thereabouts. If you're in the West, I think you'll see better. And um, uh, But most of Jamaica should be able to see that, that, that partial eclipse. Yes, my brother, go ahead. Yeah, man. So, see, when, when you notice, you know, the, the trend, I want to go on Jamaica, and the same thing, not, not really different. Mm-hmm. See? Mm-hmm. But we now have to educate the youth them. See, and make them know what really are going on because they never really stop, you know, mm-hmm. to continue. Yeah. Because if you notice, election are run and them can't even find a, 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 a winner. So you see how desperate so, people... So, so let me let me ask you, I might have missed it uh, somewhere along the line. Who who won that local government election? Well, hmm. it is neither here nor there for me still, you know, mm-hmm. Kabo, because... You know, my no, but my you, you made the point that they can't even find a winner. So yeah, is it that they have not found a winner, or it, it, it mean that none of them want to be loser, want, okay. want to be a okay. loser? Yes, yes. So you just see where the trainer are. Quantum superposition. Yeah, <laughs> see, so, so, oh, oh, open the box. Yes. Some people find themselves in a position now where them can't be a loser because them not really trust the system. And you know, it it, it 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 is a thing where it's, some of them bring them family, bring in all kind of. You understand? Mm-hmm. So, and I try even part the system, and I live where them can keep themselves. You, you know what I mean? But yes. my thing is this, you know, Cabo. When me want to see right now, because if you notice, you know, when twen- when the twenty fifth come, you know, say a Christmas that. Mm-hmm. Easter, coming in April or March or whatever. I mean, I like to see a fixed election date for them, mm-hmm. even when I don't really believe in a freedom system. So. Well, I can't use Easter as an example. See, yeah, <laughs> yeah, because Easter is on a different level. See, yeah. but may I say... Right. Right. But, but I understand the point you're making that we need... But, but that's supposed to be in the whole constitutional reform, isn't it? So, yeah. um, you know, when they go to the town hall meetings or when they're having the discussions on constitutional reform, what what level of participation does the, uh, the, the do the people have? Uh, what's the level of well, consultation? At, and that must, that must, of course, be one... When you look again, you know, the whole constitution reform again, you know, with the ellipses fixed, you know, Mm-hmm. It's, it's, it's a tainted thing, you know, where them can't even, and all the people who are in a parliament right now can't mm-hmm. even deal with it. Mm-hmm. This constitutional reform. Why, why is that? You, you can't have tainted people and deal with constitution. Constitution is, is, is large, large, you know, that, that govern country. So, um, you understand? Yes. yes. So it, 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 it's so tainted now that you wonder where Jamaica is going. When you look at Jamaica, Jamaica mm-hmm. will fight. Mandela free and, 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 and fight for certain free in South Africa and all them things. Jamaica can't even make a vote see, at, 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 the, at the UN anymore. Because Jamaica has changed its ideology though and um, and that change is, is evident. I think it's, it's for us. Maybe maybe we are suffering from a cognitive dissonance. In, in other words, we think that the Jamaica that we think of is a Jamaica that, that in terms of those who are governing and those who are leading yeah, the, this yeah. process. They, that's not the Jamaica that they they envision. That's not Jamaica they're seeing. That's not the Jamaica in, in the context in which they're operating. They're operating from a whole different context, which is has nothing to do with the Jamaica of the 70s or even the 80s. It has nothing to do with that ideolo- ideology that Jamaica had of liberation and freedom for all and etc. No. Jamaica has changed. Jamaica is now a Zionist um, state supporting. I was getting there right. yeah. when you you can look at um Palestine or I war going see in Gaza in Israel right now. Yes. Right? And you 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 can make a vote. That means say you, 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 you sit and watch and see women and children, thirty two thousand as even one of them are give the 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 you know a lot more, right? Yes. And you sit and watch and see something like that. I go on. 
But we have a, you know, we have a politician coming out and saying that I support Israel in what they're doing without apology. We have had politicians apology. saying that in the spaces yeah. and without consequences. This is a point I'm trying to make. So, you know? so those ruling class, they're, they're a whole different set of people. It is our cognitive dissonance that is preventing us from calling them to boot. They have the ideology of Jamaica is a neoliberal ideology based yeah. of Americanism. And, and they're shameless. And, and they're shameless with it. As a matter of fact, one of the questions we need to ask um, in terms of where Jamaica is, we need to ask what is the level of the extent of Israel's investment in Jamaica? What is the extent of Israel's uh, presence in Jamaica, what to what extent is Israel responsible for Jamaica's cyber um, security? Yeah. Uh, these are some questions that we must ask as, as journalists. I know we need to ask those, but as a people, we must ask them questions uh, loud and clear, especially when it comes to Israel's investments and Israel's um, control of Jamaica's cyber security. These questions must be asked and answered. You see, this is what this is what I say, and you know, that's why I say two term no no politician, no prime minister not supposed to do more than two terms. And we must all if we have a law we will add it. Because if a man not have nothing to hide, he's not afraid for really. You understand? Mm -hmm. to represent or whatever. Mm -hmm. Two term and we add it what a prime minister do. Mm -hmm. You know, that means uh, if a man do something where we have a investigate him or if he may enrich himself where well, we have to get back wealth and riches from him mm -hmm. for the country you know and we have to do it we have to do it but all of them laws this you know mm -hmm. really involved in uh, the, the, the new constitution mm -hmm. you, 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 you know what i mean mm -hmm. because are we you know are we have to set certain things you know to bring, to bring them thing at them you understand to get them thing together you know Yes, bring them yes. where we can rule them because them people are work for us. A lot of people, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of our people are afraid of the consequences of activism, advocacy, and speaking out. But Chicago, you yes. know, I feel like if we if we teach the youth and show the youth, them, you know, it's easy, you know, because you know, say even at the last election, where I just thirty percent vote. Me, you say, man, take all man money, you know. People take the money, near me to have, you know, mm -hmm. and, and a vote, you know. Mm -hmm. And and people take all the money and dress like 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 them, you know, and go in a polling station and vote for other people and all them things. You know? mm -hmm. So, the youth, them, if we if we teach the youth, because if you notice, they don't have civics in a school again, you know. Because they know most of the youth, they know are going. Mm -hmm. So, if you can keep the people done, it's good for them. See, but if we keep on teaching the youth, they're going to show the youth. See, the masses. See, mm -hmm. th things, things are for work. Things are for come. Yes, yes. Um, we, they, they need to channel that 70% into a cohesive uh, political force in Jamaica. Yeah. Uh, is, 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 a, is, a, is a tangible need. It's a critical. Uh, yeah. Everybody's waiting for a leader. Uh, and and this is and, and one of the things I try to talk about in this space is is leaderfulness and what that means, um, so that we lead from where we are uh, instead of sitting and waiting on a leader. Uh, yeah. uh, you know, I noticed something in America. I'm not quite sure if it can happen here. That those who are in the primaries, uh, mm -hmm. those who are don't want to vote for Biden, and they are Democrats but are yeah. upset with his policies in Israel, that they add a, 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 another option, which is, mm. which, 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 you know, shows their displeasure. I'm not quite, I, I don't remember exactly what is written on the ballot, but it's to say, we're not voting for you because of your policies in Israel, your stance on, on Israel, Palestine. So I think it, it, that is protest. Even if you have to spoil the ball like that way, that is protest. But at the same time, for us, I think it is urgent for us to channel that 70%, the energy of that 70% to 
into a political powerhouse. Yeah, man, and, and, and look, 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 look the program, you know. Give thanks, my brother. Much program, yeah, give thanks. Bless you again, Jerry. Welcome back. Yeah, give thanks. Welcome, Jerry. I don't have no heard from Jerry. I didn't know he was back. Yeah. Give thanks. Give thanks. Yeah, all right. Bye. All right. Yeah. Link me, Jerry. All right, you're inside of the Africa Forum. This is Running African. We're taking your telephone calls this morning. One of the reasons we decided to, in the African way, because as we say in African philosophy, the philosopher is both a, a, a speaker and part of the listening audience. And we know that we've got many, many philosophers uh, in the listening audience. And we want to hear from you this morning. Also, I really want to hear your take on this whole um, hula balloon around the solar eclipse, but also your own take on on the spirituality of it, um, your take on um, what we should be doing now uh, as, as as Africans, or just your take on the conspiracy of it, <laughs> the conspiracy theories uh, of it, because there are many of those going around as we go back to the phone lines. Hello, good morning, greetings. Hello. Hi, greetings. Oh, chap, let's go. Oh, chap, oh, chap. How you doing? Um, good, good. I'm yes, looking nice. to go on the street now and get the exercise. But... Really? Okay. Yes. 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 Um, uh, yes. So, it's come up in order. Why? For how long? They must say it has got eclipse. But I think they must say on that side of the world here. They may even have the trajectory part. Wait, yeah, I know, part. I know. We're, not, we're, we're going to see, parts of Jamaica will see partial, a partial eclipse. Um, uh, one about a, uh, nine minutes to one o'clock, but um, it, it, where it's going to be at, at the, the path of totality, they call it, is, is, yeah, is in the yeah. US, Mexico, Canada, parts of um, Ireland, but definitely yeah. the US. Yes, yes, yes. Mm-hmm. So I guess the great America, I guess, you know, the greatness there, we uh, light shining there. We, well, then, but, then I said, in the great, the great North America, <laughs> the great North America and solar eclipse. Well, solar eclipse. I hope everybody see it. Them place they kind of jump in, you know, so them are jar, them national guard, no, the place that really dangerous. So then meanwhile, they can go on things that plans to go on in there too. There's a lot of so, movement. There's a lot of movement already. I think right. lots of people have moved into the areas. Hotels are booked in in the path of totality. All the hotels, right. are, all the nearby and and, ho- and the hotels within that are fully booked. I understand. Right. So everybody keeps safe and well tied to things. Well, may I step away from America a little bit. I may go over England here. I may go give my um, sympathies and my most heart uh, one felt to Miss Abbott. Yes. Um, I, I wish her to continue doing whatever she's doing over there from that angle. Mm-hmm. Represent the same way. And Mr. Frank, I last him here and he beat before, you know, mm-hmm. since he got called up here, they might chastise him out here a little. But it seems like they are, the authority are the angles we are using. Them free that them, 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 what you call it now? Them lucrative. Are them liquidity where they get from here? It's so interesting them because they look into. Well, we can allow them to look into. But, no, no, but, no. no. But, 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 but weeks now, you're the panic, you know. So yeah. the fear says something get free. Yeah, right. there's a question oh, to be answered. Are. There's a question to be answered. Yeah, the, so why your friendship the, get cut off? The extent. We don't want your nothing answer about that friendship cut off. What, what the fear? No, no, beyond, no, beyond, beyond, beyond. Different, no. no, beyond beyond the, the, the medical um is is contract with the Ministry of Health. Beyond his contract, Frank Hester's mm-hmm. contract with the Ministry of Health is, yes. is an egregious situation right now. Um beyond that, there's another Come there's in. another question to be answered. And that question is what is the extent, if any, of Frank Hester's campaign financing of the Jamaica Labour Party in Jamaica? What is the extent, if any? of his campaign financing or his um, sponsoring of or his contribution to the Labour Party, if any. No, that must no, be that just, no, that they're just in peace with them. It looks like it be because if he can't be touched that easy out here. It says a lot. Meanwhile, if the lady out there is a mechanist in our pot, because she can't have a mechanist in our shop, they might go find her the next day and lock her down and lock down the whole of the crab circle and the ear circle and yeah. so on. Except for yourself. And that man expect them to do for this about because now you are representing a black nation. It's a black country. Yeah. Right. Jamaica. Jamaica is not a white man or it's not France yeah. or it's not Africa. See? And it, that them need to step more step up in a step in a man. 
because it, yeah, but it seems to me that they're, they're not going to do anything about it. Um, not yeah, that, that, not, that, not that as it is now. Not as it now. Because yeah. it's them say they're going to look into as to we have we have got this continue yeah. the relationship with these guys. Yes. What, that look that looks steep away. Well, well, the, 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 the People's National Party has they they need to to step up and put some pressure on the government to them have no to, tea, to, to much look at no, them. Them are yes. much tea, them, them 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 you know um, quantum superposition aside. Them them them, them not control the parish council, so them have a whole appetite. So, yes. so 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 now they can they can pressure the government um, to. Literally, cancel that contract right. with this racist person yes. out of the UK. You're putting somebody who's as racist as him in charge of the medical documents of black yeah. women and, and men. Animal, in Jamaica. Right. Yeah, and then when we hear an animal, like in, in, in my phone, or tear or, or food, even if a food would yes. have. Someone because who has looked at a black woman and said she should I be love shot. I love my black ladies. I love the black queen. Oh my God, you are so beautiful. I know me is fret for them, and when me hear this, no. So we that sh- means we should that be asking another question. Another question. No, another, no. another question that needs to be answered is the extent of Frank Hester's investment throughout the Caribbean. Well, it seems them pinpointed and them have him in our region. And, and them can't have a, get a whole eye, so I don't feel it should have taken more. I have to take round a break. And round. I have to take a break, my brother. Thank you so much for calling. All right. All right. When I need to order... Mm. 55 and over, uh, I think, 50, yeah, 55 and men, a similar age, 55, 51. So you had to be 55 and over to be let in by Israel. So Israel ha- had or has um, guardrails around the Alaska mosque. It is heavily guarded. And Muslims are not allowed to go in, are now experiencing all kinds of health issues. And that's why 55 become, uh, becomes for them an, a much older age. You know, um, so odd, uh, normally 55, uh, say even in Jamaica, is a, a young boy and girl. Uh, and, and, I'm, and I'm not being flippant about that. So this is a, the situation now in, in Gaza where Muslims are being denied entry to the Al-Asqa Mosque at the end of Ramadan. I'm going to just let you talk. You have uh, just about three minutes. Oh, I was just looking um, at the eclipse. Yes. You know, and looking at it from a perspective of rejuvenation. Mm-hmm. Yeah, a reconfirmation of the Almighty. Yes. Of the family, family reunion. Exactly. Mother Earth. Mm-hmm. Father, son, mm-hmm. and baby moon. <laughs> I, I love baby moon. <laughs> yeah. Yes. And so, if you look at the perspective from so it, the... So anyway, the mother, the, so the grandmother comet, that comet that is blasting through the air right now, that them give a, 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 an inauspicious name. Um, I, that, that's um, grand, gra, sorry, grandma comet. Maybe. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, but yeah. if you look at even the two perspectives from the... The, the creation of what you call a diamond ring. Mm-hmm. You know, the crown yes. of the ring first, and yes. at the bottom, and the crown of the ring at the top. Yes. It signifies man and woman. There and you go. Yeah. True. So, so I see yes. a kind of re- reaffirmation mm-hmm. from the Almighty about the power of the family. Yes. Yeah, and, and there's, there's a lot of fear um, that is being ramped up on the social media, and even and then, even it's deliberate. Uh, and, 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 and I think it, it's good for us to just enter the space and to say, you know, no, 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 nothing to fear here. Out of darkness come light, so we also see that a kind of rejuvenation. The darkness, is, the darkness is illuminating. This is the ah. thing. Darkness for us is not negative. Darkness is illuminating. Yeah. yeah. So it's, it, it's, it's positive from many perspectives. This yes. demonic perspective. Um, demons around us from here and then. And yes. uh, you know some visible to some people and some are not, you yes. know. Yeah. And uh, we meet them every day, but it's always just glory evil all the time. Yes. You know. Yeah, because and, the, evil is as evil does, and and we know that when you look at uh, we, we we call them all kinds of things. We call them sociopaths, psychopaths, narcissists. I mean, these are demons in in human form. 
We don't need any clips to let us see them, you know? <laughs> <laughs> but we know some funny other side of the clips. We've got enough people to die. I got open. That's why I didn't give it that's why I didn't give it a name already. A quick Point. word. <laughs> For support metamorphosis. <laughs> yes. A quick word on Haiti. Mm. Um if the Central Bank of New York would return it is gold, which now value twenty six billion dollars that is stolen to um just after that um, invasion and then nurtured invasion in 1915. When they said the took every single piece of gold that Haiti yes, had yes. to their bank that is still there now. Mm-hmm. And that is why they are one of the largest bank reserve um, mm-hmm. institution in this part of the world. Return Haitian gold, they could transform the country just that mm-hmm. alone. Remember, remember that's why they overthrew um, the, the, the only democratically elected government in Haiti for a very long time, Bertrand, John Bertrand Aristide, because he was asking for reparations and asking for what rightfully belongs to Haiti. So they, Precisely. I think so that's the, what we in the Caribbean should be rallying around. This is what we should be doing, but Caribbean people is going to have, it's going to have to be a grassroots situation because Caribbean leaders have joined the agenda of the oppressor. Didn't you see what happened in Kingston there? Weasels, man. These are young weasels. And we put, I don't know if all they emerge to the top. Uh, it is It yeah. is a crisis. It's a crisis in the Caribbean. Yeah. Crisis of leadership. I'm disappointed yes. in even me, I'm yes. actually. These are what people, these are some individuals who claim that said they are part of the neoliberal um, agenda. Process, you know, yes. a yes. transformation, turning yeah. us all into. Yeah. Um, Slaves, digital and techno slaves, all kind of slaves. Yeah, they are possessed. The the, they are possessed. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and and well, my brother, thank you so much. Uh, we yes, have just a minute to go. Let us welcome the Almighty as he visits. Uh, <laughs> and she. Bless you. And she. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, give thanks. And then um, yeah. big up the man over with Harry at school I play ball. Big up on the cell phone, keep yes. the unity set. Yes. But Wednesday night a man call. A regular call a call where I talk about the police no man out of them job and anything there. Mm-hmm. But the man I talk about the extortionist the man. You can't have a society we have extortionists around the country, you know. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll use our government to I know that we're being, I'm, my, my, my apologies, because I know that there's yeah. a phone that's ringing in the background and it's coming from my end. So if we could just ask yeah. our telephone operator, please hold the calls. And I'm taking one at a time. I can't take two at a time. So if you could pull back the calls and let me get through just the one that I have online at a time. Um, I'm not quite sure if you're hearing that. I'm, I, there's nothing I can do about it. So no, from, I, from the I, studio. I, I hear you fine enough. I yes. hear you fine enough. All right. So, yes, go so ahead. What, 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 yeah, because like I said, it's a big concern to me as a, as a person when I'm a back to defend me of nothing. You understand? I hear the man talk about uh, the extortionists, them around, uh, extort the, the man from the boss. And the man, no key or couldn't key or whatever, and the man just take a piece of like, this middle seat in the vehicle and start beat the man. Oh, wow. And then go to support time, we are standing there. It just, you can't have them so there and we say we have the last civil society. You know yes. what I mean? That's the concern is to me. Yes. Um. So where do we start? Because obviously this has to be a multifaceted, and we've been saying that for years. But um, the start of it. Intervention, it can't, because this is one space. But then... Yeah. If nothing is being done all the way from uh, kindergarten, then this is, we have, it's it's a vicious cycle that we have. Yeah. And we can't allow it to continue. We cannot allow it to continue. And 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 and, and I blame leadership. You see the leadership of the country, the government, as you say, the prime minister, I don't know where Israel they have funny man what Israel up and the whole of them like when them go for vote against when you should vote them can't vote against Israel even when the, the, the blade and thing are going on. Well there's obviously it. something. There is obviously yeah. something and we're not suffering from no cognitive dissonance around here. There is obviously yeah. something. The answer is in the question, you know. The answer is in yeah. the question. I'm posing the question, but I know very well that the answer is in the question. You understand and what I'm other, saying? But, but the other thing about that then. Why, if you 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 are going to vote to them people and you say, "Well, be like them people," there's some form of stability in a them country. You know, me you know, say, you, you, every country have its black eye and its blue eye or whatever. You know, them filthiness. You know, but you know, have no large 
extortion we are going to Israel. Where, where, where well, I think, well I, I think you might be very wrong about that. No, because, I, this not, hear what I'm saying. Yes. I, I know, mm. you hear what I'm saying. All right, let me make you finish. Like, mm-hmm. I, under, I understand so there's extortionists and all them things there everywhere now. Mm. Mm. Oh, because the extortionists are in the... What do you call it? Kiss, kiss net, kiss, 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 whatever that place is. In the parliament, the Knesset. It, it's, it's, yeah. in the, it's in the, in the parliament. Yeah. The, the extortionists yeah. are right there because yeah. we saw what happened in the last election. Yeah. And we see oh, how okay. Netanyahu has um, mm-hmm. literally caught out, and, and, and although this is what he wanted anyway, to mm-hmm. the extremists in the parliament and the extent yeah. to which there was some serious level of extortion. Mm-hmm. Um, well, what I'm saying is that you can't have just a little, a, a little, it be the norm in our society where the little man on the street have no protection. Yes. You can't have a society yes. run just like that. Yes. And that will concern me. Yes. Like, you know, you see a piece, first of all, we call a madman. A man can't just beat him up or deal with him. Yes. A man, you know. Lawlessness. We need, we need to defend the people and we cannot defend themselves. All right, how do we do that? How do we do that? That is a question. How we do it? Mm. You know, you change the education system because the people have educated this capitalist education where it's greed, 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 and me have always have more than you to show up on you. That is the biggest problem in the education system where we teach greed and we must always have somebody to look down on and we must always have somebody to look up to. That are one of the problems. But you have to have a security system in place. You have to have people get arrested, bring to trial and charge and put in prison. You can't have people just are beat up people, some man. Them think they're sick with some up, man. Yeah, it is a very serious situation. This is the, serious, law, the lawlessness. Of, of, to me, that's why yes. they worry about it. Now. It will happen to me. Yes, it's a, it's a level it, of, of bullying at our levels. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't, I don't believe in them thing that. But, but another thing, you see, look at the road rage. There's a level of road rage in Jamaica that is frightening. I um, tell you, enough, we need to tear up the curriculum and start from scratch. Mm-hmm. We need to teach the people how to live. Mm-hmm. It doesn't make no sense. You have big over, drive over, you have the big. Pretty road and pretty car, and you don't know if you live amongst one another. The greatest thing is to you know if you live amongst people. Values, values, values and attitudes. Thank and uh, this is something that is lacking. I remember when PJ Patterson brought it up that he was laughed at. And this is interesting because can you imagine if we had started implementing that from them time there, even at the kindergarten yeah, level, that, what, what, what difference might have been because there are many other things that probably would, wouldn't but then you know you can just imagine how different that might have been so what value what are our values because we have values we have values you know when you look mm-hmm. at the videos uh on tiktok coming out of the schools for example with the young girls who are doing all these sex sexualized dancing um along with their teachers male and female the I extent, do not watch those things, you know. The extent, it's it important to look at the pandemic on my brother. I, become it, my you know, I, I know, my I, I know. don't watch those garbage. But listen, you know the, I mean? the, but, we, but this is what is happening. And if the teachers and the system did allow for values and attitudes to be brought into the school in the very same way, in other words, the, 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 the enthusiasm and the passion with which you, teachers participate in these sexualized dances, the latest trend, what I drift or whatever I'm doing. Um, if they, if if we could get, because we know that if you if you if, if you put things to music, children yeah. will learn easier. Yeah. So if you yeah. could make, yeah. to make some of those very same, put some of some some values and attitudes, lyrics and those very same rhythms. Yeah. It might but make a difference, me. It will. It will. But you know what, Kabo? We do have any. We lack the leader. Visionary leadership. These people, all them thinking about is they they left millions and uh, uh, millions give them them grand pick them. I think to see them pick them up only them are gonna see later on. You think so when you only for hungry people are come and your picnic and your picnic look like them them successful. You just uh, them are gonna be the beat. Let me tell you that. 
It is like, a so when we, we, but, but this is, you see, because I've been in this space for so long and having these very same conversations, and we are, mm-hmm. and we are, it, it, and it's getting worse. This is, you know, it's getting worse. This is my experience. I've been doing this for mm-hmm. a while. And so my question then is, so is there no end to it? And and if so, what is the solution? That's the thing, you know. <laughs> The solution is in the education system. This, like you said, put those things, but you know what? We're lacking leaders who are willing, who have the gall to make the strong decisions because everybody just have focused on them next election. They may, they, that's why you know these people have, I don't even know what to say because these people have nothing about them. All them think about freedom picnic. All I like you, like when you're in the, the Virgin Mary and the culture, boy, even could have, you know, when could have a strong legacy, I say, yo, I need to fix this in the country, and I need to put this in all in my thing for this, I have 50 million property fee for him, pick to them. You can't think for that alone. You're in a position, a lead 50 years down the road, you want you to make it to say, oh, somebody, oh, you see the Prime Minister, where they the prime minister is in a paradigm that it, it, it don't have a paradigm shift on his part he's going to have to reimagine um a, 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 a safe jamaica uh um a jamaica that have high standards high, yeah. high, high values moral standards um, yeah. lacking in, in, in corruption. He has to reimagine that. He's not able to do that because he himself um, he, he, he's locked into he's locked into this he, he's locked into this paradigm where yeah. it, it, it is what would it mean if for example the Prime Minister um, the, the documents that are being requested by the Integrity Commission and others that those will be handed in by the, the those belonging mm-hmm. to the Prime Minister will be handed in. Uh, you, you understand the point I'm making? And yeah, I do. So, so, right. so because corruption is at the level that it is in Jamaica, it is, and because it is coming from the top down, yeah. uh, the outlook, the outlook is not good. But I think that we can change it from the bottom up and I go once again to the seventy percent. It seems like apathy, but it's not apathy. It is actively demanding something else, but we can't just demand it. We have to be it. We can't excuse ourselves from the process. We have to participate mm-hmm. in the process at various mm-hmm. different levels. Mm-hmm. And I, I, I go and say, I go and say something. I leave you know, but will my people probably won't agree with it. With what me have said, but yes, when we when we think Jamaica is right now, we have to have something like a truth and reconciliation situation in the country. Where 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 they're about, we have to know say some people they do some illegal activity over there, so and we are go. I don't believe it. You know, let me tell you why I don't believe it. You see, and when them do, you see when that truth and reconciliation don't they have to go baptize them and them filled with the Holy Ghost in the name of whoever because. You, you mm-hmm. can, we see, we saw what happened in South Africa. This truth mm-hmm. and reconciliation thing don't work. It don't yeah, work. No, it, but, the, 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 but, the poor but, are more oppressed. Maybe my idea, eh? Yeah, but maybe my idea with me have is probably different from a South Africa have. Because right. me I say, me I say, like some of these guys, in a public interest, we have to get rid of them. And you, in all of you know, the school field massacre where we need, because we, to clean up the system. We go and say, yo, you did response. We the word on the street, we can't prove it, but the word on the street is that you did do that. Here we are gonna do. You are gonna move from this and we know what I see in other community there as long as you live. And we are gonna clean up. And you see some of the youth and we get murdered, we are gonna build a mural with all of them named there. We just uh, 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 just let me ask you a question. Yeah. What is it, what is the role of those who have money, those who are operating at very high levels in the society, in carrying in guns and facilitating corruption on the island? Because, because so you, oh, I look at that. You have to deal with them. You have to deal with them. So like moving forward, because like, moving forward, you catch them, you have to go. You have to lock them with a long time. I have to probably kill some of them too. 
we are, we, we are not facilitating. We, 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 listen, let me just say this. We're not, condo, we're not condoning killing anybody on this on this program. I know what you said, and I understand. I understand what you mind. Um, but we're not. Yeah. I, I really do have to to do this this, this disclaimer. We're not condoning the killing of of, of of anyone. But as if somebody is yeah. found to have committed a crime, and mm -hmm. and and whether and 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 if the crime and if they are responsible if for, yeah. for, for for say giving guns to others who use yeah. those guns to murder others, then they themselves must face a death penalty. You understand? Right. And I think this is where you're going. Thank you so much, my brother. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I might have to remind you, I might have to let out everybody out of prison and, and start over the world system, though. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big, it's a big, it's a big problem. Look at you, you look at you, go on. <laughs> no, I, I don't <laughs> Thank you so much, my brother, for coming. Big up yourself, Thank you, thank you. Not quite sure if this caller is still there, but I know the phone has been ringing off the hook. Let me go to the phone lines. Uh, greetings. Greetings, my sister. Hi, thank you so much for holding. Yeah, man. Uh, I, I, you know, we have to have exercise some patience sometimes in that's life. A, that's a whole lot. to get you, that's you have a, to exercise patience. That's a whole lot of... those people regret the very act that they did because nature is not such that it doesn't change nature transforms nature illuminates well, let, me, let, me, let, let, me, let me ask you this what if what, what about the law where does the law fall in all of this if, if somebody does you wrong what kind of wrong are you talking about mm -hmm. then is, that, is it wrong to the extent that this person should be locked up just should go to court and the trial and and, and so on, or you're talking about somebody tell life and you're here, so what kind of wrong? What was well, the extent in, in of both the cases, In both cases, Paul, because wrong is wrong. Whether it's, it's, All right. so, so, because the law, the law to me, so the if, law is, is, just, um, is just there as a showpiece. Because you can't have a law that doesn't have a so, justice so the person, I understand. So the person who does wrong, and you say revenge, but the yeah. person who does wrong, um, how is that person to be punished? Is um, it's gonna return on you? So your punishment is gonna come by your own action. And what if that person? Deed. What if that person kills someone? Well, um, I don't think if you kill someone, killing that the person is gonna solve the problem. No, this is why I asked about the law. So, so because yes. I'm trying to understand what you mean when you say people shouldn't take revenge. I'm trying to understand the extent. Of, well, the, my, of the of the of the crime or of the wrong, what what kind well, of wrong? Well, my thing, you know, is that um, in terms of somebody, all right, let me let me use an example. Mm -hmm. We're looking at in the in the same region where the people doing the scamming and the the, the um, and the um, the gangsterism and all of that. Mm -hmm. Somebody might stole a gun from some from from the, the, the leader, and in return, you want to kill that person. It, and think that it is revenge. But the person doesn't really feel that pain because when you die, you don't feel any pain. And, and, and as a result of that, our brothers and sisters are now killing their one another because of a system that was set up by the powers that be to infiltrate and to eliminate the black race. Because I, have I don't know if I don't, I, I don't, I'm not quite sure if I'm following what you're saying. Uh -huh. um, and, and I'm going to try and follow you. Uh, yeah. If if someone kills another person, shouldn't that person face the law? Of course, of course, I, I believe that. I, I'm saying that you, as an average citizen, you know, should not take revenge. Oh, in, I see. You, okay, way. okay, yeah. You as a yes. I, yeah, I, yes, I do agree. I get the point you're yes. making. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yes. It took me a while. My my apologies. Okay. <laughs> 
Okay. Yes. All right. But notwithstanding that, even when you look at um, my brother speak a while ago about extortion. Mm -hmm. But if you if you lead, you must lead by example. And the governments of today, they are extortionists. That is true. Free church leaders are extortionists. So you are saying to the average persons out there, it is okay for you to continue in that trend. Because look, when you look at the, the, the thing, Cabo, can somebody pay the security company a million dollars for, for, for argument's sake to protect their business place, which is still being robbed, broken into? And, and when somebody gave some, so an extortionist at $50,000 per month, their business would be properly protected. It's a failure of the leadership of the government of the country. They are falling they short they, on what they're supposed to do to protect the people and to make everybody live in harmony and peace. And to sleep with them windows open. And to sleep with them windows and their doors open. Yeah, the failure the failure is long, long before that. Because the fact that right? we the fact that we have to hire um security at such exorbitant sums tells us the extent of um the fear and the crime and the violence on the island so exactly. the, 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 the responsibility to the, to the to the nation is way before that the um successive ministers of um uh, a government uh, uh, security so successive um commissioners of police have failed have failed and, and, and they fail and then they celebrate their failure and pat, and pat each other on the yeah. and the people yeah. are okay with it. You know, I was laughing the other day, Kabu. I was laughing at a statement that was made by the, the, the present minister of agriculture, and he was rebutting the president of the Jamaica Agricultural uh, um, Society. Agricultural Society, then we're Fulton, because Mr. Fulton said that he doesn't believe that government both past and present government has done enough to develop agriculture. And politically, the minister came out and said he doesn't know what he's talking about because this government has done so much. The man never said never do anything. The man said he's see, that's another really. thing is that everybody is so sensitive. But whoever, I didn't hear that statement from from Mr. Fullerton. Uh, Fullerton is a person's name, so yes. Ful so Fullerton is right. And yeah, um, right. and and the minister would have it would have served him right. And I'm just going off what you said because I didn't hear all of this. Would have served yes. him better. If he had had a sit down with Mr. Fullerton to say, what are your ideas? Let us see how we can make it better. Because I am with Mr. Fullerton in 100%. Successive okay. governments have done nothing for food security on this island. have done hardly anything for agriculture. All they do is have big parties and um, not glasses. And at the end of the day, we find that we have lost most of our, our natural seeds. We have imported GMOs. We have imported Roundup. We have killed off uh, 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 so much of our indigenous plants, our foods, and so on. And we are about to face a famine unless we can find a way to pull this back. This is, this is, this is not a joke business. The Fullerton is right. He's exactly perfectly right, my, my sister. But let me tell you something. I've been trying to teach some of our farmers that these GMO products does not offer any nutrients to the people. You know, I remember having an argument with a, 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 Rasta, so a Rasta man in, in Ultrius when I, I went there to, to, to deliver some vegetables. Mm -hmm. And I had clean, pretty cabbages. And he was saying to me that, yeah, I don't want your cabbages. Can you see them clean? He said, no, you kill them with spray. I said, and there you go wrong. Because nature doesn't compromise. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you something, Gabo. I let out my, my chickens. And I'm not talking about chickens, no, I'm talking about chickens. Mm -hmm. When they go out there, just watch what they do. Mm -hmm. They are the sole manufacturer of nutrients for the soil. Mm -hmm. They provide free, uh, they eliminate insects, that's number one. Mm -hmm. And they, 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 they fertilize, they fer the fertilization that you're supposed to get, one of my brethren called it the other day and talked about the dirty lies. He's right. <laughs> yes, yes. He's right. Yes. Right? Because when you look at how nature nature performs, it doesn't make any mistake. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? No, that's quite and, true. And I, I like the I like the point you're making about the natural way you're you're growing your cabbage and and so on and the fact that we can ha we can produce our own fertilizers and if we can't we can get them from other places in the caribbean and so on but we don't have to bring in the gmos the thing about that is that we have and and listen we don't have to, we don't have to shout from the rooftop you know we, are, we already do the shouting which we we lost this <laughs> war we lost this war um, I don't know if you recall, we had demonstrations all across Jamaica against, against the importation 
of uh, of GMO products without labeling, but the extent to which they, to which they were being imported, but also against the way that we were farming, which was using Roundup, and uh, and 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 apart from cancer that that entail for our farming, for our food, for our food security. Even to the states I'm talking to you, Jamaicans are still using Roundup. Do you know what the end result of that is? Today I'm noticing that the the United Nations has put out a report today to say that uh, increasing global water security is causing more and more conflicts around the world and that um, the report was released is, is, is a world, UN World Water Development Report 2024. They released it on Friday. They said that 2.2 billion people worldwide have no access to clean drinking water and 3.5 billion people lack access to safely manage sanitation. Now, we are in a situation where we are not even protecting in terms of agriculture, our water sources. We have given away and sold away and, and bargain away our water sources to foreign entities on the island. Without water, there is no agriculture. So, so the end result of Roundup, lack of water, lack of access to water is, for, for me, I don't know if you can see it down the road, but well, what, what I see is, is, is daunting. Let me tell you something, and I think what, one of the things that we, we need to do as well, Carbo, is just not stressing the fact about Roundup, because a lot of farmers are using Roundup and don't even know that they are using Roundup, That's because true. there is a chemical called glyphosate, yes. which is the active ingredient in Roundup. Yes, yes. Now, that, that same glyphosate or Roundup, what it does, it goes into the soil and it holds the nutrient that, that the plant is supposed to get. Mm -hmm. So then you have to in turn buy these fertilizer mm -hmm. and force the plant to take nutrients, which still goes back to the Roundup and it lasts for six years. That cycle, one use of Roundup will last for six years. And what about and what about replanting? What happens? Can you replant? That, you, what no, happens you to that soil? You can't replant the genetically modified seeds. No, you can't. The, the farmers are complaining. We can't get corn in all the farm stores. I said, oh, what I tell you a long time? I, just, I never buy corn. I never fertilize my corn. I never fertilize my local red peas. I have them all the time. And so some of the people were telling me, they, oh, they're not buying my corn because when they buy the people come in and all of that. I said, okay. But I keep planting my corn. I keep planting my peas. I've never gone to a store to buy peas. And I've never gone to the market to buy corn because I won't be getting corn and I won't be getting peas. Well, well, you know, I thank Mother, Father, God for you on the island and for and for people like you who are struggling against, literally going against the tide to ensure that when the hotter clubs come, we can still have a little bit to eat. My um, sister, I, keep, and, and so, I keep showing some farmers, you know, I keep showing some farmers products that mm -hmm. I achieve, what I reap, yes. like the same cabbage they're trying to plant. And what they can do, what most farmers doesn't know, to get rid of this genetically modified cabbage seed that they send to them. If you plant it once, don't buy any more seed, I beg you. Just break the spring in from the plant because cabbage is also a tree of life. And but, if you break but there's the a patent. The but, but do you know there's a patent? There's a patent on the GMO seeds, you know, that if that you, you if you plant the seed and then go back and, and don't buy new seeds and go back and try and plant replant seeds, um, there can be there can be consequences for that. You know, you, do you know that? Yeah, I know, I know. I, okay. I, I read all of I read all of that. But, but in this case, the, 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 the what you're doing in this from the plant. You what plant you the same plant that, that you buy from them, you see, that you buy from Okay, them. okay. Well, right? that, when, that was the problem that Malawi had, you know. Remember Malawi, that was the problem they had, you know. Yeah. But um, what I'm saying, if you grow the plant and it receives and you plant the seeds, that's where they, 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 the issue. Okay. But if you okay. send me a seed and I plant a seed, and, and as long as that tree is alive, you can't do me anything for that. Okay, tree. I see what you mean. I see what you yeah. mean. Yeah, and the cabbage tree can stay alive for, uh, for as long as you live. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. One tree. Just let the farmers out there who are listening know that. Yeah, right? but, but, but my brother, I really want to beg Jamaican people. I, mean, I, I am at the begging stage now to plant some long-term trees where you can, like, so, um, so, where you call it, you know, sour sap, um, sour sap, jackfruit, star apple, jackfruit yeah. um, 
cashew, all Aki, of them plants. Aki, cashew, all of them big tree there because look here. You know, and, you know, you know I, I try to do a lot of um, plants like that. And, and, yes. and I, I heard you earlier on trying to get um, stanzarine. Um, one of the ways you can get plants from the, 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 the trees is to do circumposition. Right. If, if you circumpose the, the citrus, mm -hmm. you will have plants that bear within a year. Yes. Almost. And you know, so I know if you do that something now, because I do agricultural science at school, you know. But I don't know if you remember. I don't know if you cut it and put the thing over it and, and so on. All and right. Yeah. 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 But somebody can it. circumpose it for me. Uh, no, I think we have to do it. If I, get, if, if I get to one of the trees, yes. I, 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 I can do that. But it's yes. one of the simple ways, because education teaches. So, and, and the education is not in the classroom. I want everybody to understand that. Yes. Knowledge is what teaches. Yes. I, I remember some religious people back me down into a conversation one day and they started and I tell them that I refuse the present education system is to fool the people and trick the people. And they were of a different view. So I asked them one simple question, who taught the first teacher? And they were dumb. <laughs> no, this is the first very, teacher. Very good question. Right. You know, is that I want to invite you in the studio at some time, you know, so we could talk agriculture because I think sometimes we, I know we talk a lot, but sometimes we need guidance, so we call you in for guidance. So I want to invite I, you in the I, studio. I will be available at, at yes. whenever you you are ready. All right. Please, yeah, because please, I, please I, listen, I listen to Irie FM every Sunday morning. You know I participate. This is yes. the farmer from in the hills of Money. I know, I know. Yeah. I recognize yeah. you. So yeah. please and thanks may invite you, you know, to come in the studio and and let and, and help to guide us in this. I think I think we're at a critical stage in our agriculture. Yeah. Um that and and Mr. Fullerton is right. Um, and the Minister of Agriculture needs to sit down with Mr. Fullerton and people like him to see how much of this we can pull back. Well, where, where we are in Jamaica today, you know, Kabu, is that we are just looking at, a, not we, but these politicians are just looking at politicizing everything. And they, can, you know what, one of the problems we have, we don't have a strong opposition. That is number one. Number two, we don't have two party up there who will sit down and agree at what is best for the people. They agreed on what is best for them. That is the problem. It is and, a problem. And, 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 and the other issue, the other issue where I see politics is going, and I notice this trend, whenever the opposition come out to say something opposing what the government is saying or doing, they slam them in the face, bam, and they sit down like the little children and, and stop talking. And I guess that's you know, yes, they're, they're, yeah, they're, 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 they're throwing, yeah, they're throwing, they're throwing tantrums in the synagogue of Satan. And the reason for that is that there's a, the, <laughs> narcissism is in charge. Are gone here? Yes. Are we talk some other time? Uh, Give thanks. But, but you, are you going to get that, that, that contact for me, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, may I get a contact now? Yeah, that, that, that's a good question. Um, mm -hmm. uh, could you call and give it to the operator for me, please, Dan? Yes, I will. All right, good yes. Okay. Let me see, uh, I got a message from my brother. And uh, it says, Rastafari month, April 2024. Uh, hold the line for me, please. It says, this is the eighth uh, Rastafari month, headquarters, judgment yard, tabernacle, and cultural center. This is the eighth annual activation of Rastafari Month, a platform that was launched in 2017 to highlight Rastafari contributions and rights. So April 7, that's today. We're starting our April Rastafari History Month programs with a Zoom launch, recapping the history of its conceptualization and then outlining the month's proposals of activities to be live, a three hours um, Zoom forum from Sunday until Wednesday per week, ending April 28 to 30. And then it says April 8 to 10, reviewing the history of April 1st, or reviewing the history of April 1st strong activities. Sunday's programs begin at 3 to 6 p.m. Monday to Wednesday are from 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. The Zoom forum, April 7 to 10, the Zoom meeting. There is a little meeting ID. I'm not sure if uh, my prophet Greg, I'm not sure if there also needs to be a password. But anyway, it's a passcode. But it says meeting ID 873 
2820-5113. That's 873-2820-5113. So Prophet Greg, I'm not seeing I'm not seeing a passcode. So let me know if there should be one. I'm well, if you two are well, welcome to the well, place. I'm doing well. Hold mm-hmm. for my king, man, okay? Yes. Hold on. <laughs> Good morning, Kabul. Greetings, greetings, greetings. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm calling from St. Thomas. From St. Thomas, all right. Yeah. Welcome from St. Thomas. Yeah, man, big mm-hmm. up to you, Kabul. Give thanks, give thanks. Hey, okay. But the point that I want to raise, you mm-hmm. see, mm-hmm. is about a comment that you made since morning mm-hmm. to one of the callers. Yes. You know, Kabu, I think we are well fed up of what is happening today. Mm-hmm. And the thing is, if we are to make any real change, apart from bloody change, apart from bloody revolution, mm-hmm. we are to be supporting the political system to make a, a difference because we don't really want to go down the bloody route. Mm-hmm. What comment? What comment did I make? What, what comment did about you make? about a political change? Oh, okay. I was talking about the seventy percent. Um, yes, seventy percent. Oh, right. Um, that I, I, is the thing. Right. And but, I think we ought to be galvanizing. With influential people like you, you know, more, I think more, change this, can come, you know. This, but I didn't finish my sentence there, though. I talked about leaderfulness, and I'm not talking about party politics or tribal politics. Because I'm talking about a wider understanding of politics, which is to engage with the system, to understand the system, and then to know how you can influence change within the system right. without be, without being part of a system. Because this is something that I'll never do. I'll never be part of this system. It goes. I, it, I, I, it goes against everything I believe in. But I know that we can influence change of the system. Yes. And I think people up in position can make real political change. And you don't have to 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 be really getting involved. I think I think it's a grassroots. I think it's a a political change. I think it's a grassroots, it's a grassroots massive of people. I we can make a change. Grassroot people. Yes. Grassroot people. We don't have to go up in, in, in high places to find people because the 70% represent grassroot people. Of course. So I am saying that with influential people, even such as you and others, can make a big change because we have been black bombed from mainstream media most of the time. But I mean, I do what me, I do. That's why me said what me said this I, morning. I, 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 I know, but and, I, and this is, I and think we can we can take a, take it a, a bit a step further. Well, everybody wants somebody to take it a step further, and this is the point I'm making is that, and this is why I talk about purpose this morning, because we have to determine what our purpose is. I am journalisting around here. I'm a journalist. This is what I do. This is who I am. Now there are others who can be engineers and teachers and doctors in terms of their profession. And then all of we can come together and influence change, but it cannot be on the shoulder of any one person. The 70% is already a critical mass. One person cannot do it. I agree with you because Mm. Marcus did have to run. Well, stop pushing me in a air. Marcus did have have to really run. But if, if we want that kind of activism, Everyone that we have to get involved. That's the point I'm making. Everyone Every single one involved. of us. And get involved in a, in, a, in a real sense of making the change. Yeah, so when you call me in a, when you call me from out of St. Thomas and say, Carbo, we are, we, are go, we are meeting at it in a the square of Moran, Bain, and we are going to deal with food with business right out here, sir. And we want you to come in. Come give us a little strength, yes, yeah, sir. After we give you a little strength either way. Then you're gonna find me in a St. Thomas enough time he drive out yeah. of St. Thomas with stuff like those men afraid to drive come a St. Thomas with them kind of things there. This is the point I'm making. And you see, we we have a, where we are, we have to lead from where we are. 
That is what I'm doing right here now. Exactly. That is what I'm doing right here now. But the, 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 the St. Thomas, I keep saying, you know, God, St. Thomas is a place where the real revolution did really fought. And we need, St. Thomas is like it asleep now. Well, Saint Thomas, so out, the people of Saint Thomas out for lose them beaches if they're not careful. Saint Thomas, yeah. Saint Thomas people have to get up now and say, right. "Not on our like watch." No. You can't take where all our water sources, where all of the waterfalls and where all of the waterfalls them dry up because when you move the water, the water source and move it to somewhere else because when you say not develop Saint Thomas, but when you developing Saint Thomas for the private sector and for foreigners yes. and leaving yes, the people out that of Saint Thomas. Is. And that is what I have been saying. It's a three card game. Years. They're no. playing a three card game in St. Thomas. They give on a, they give on a highway. Now, you know, yeah, but they're on a highway and, 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 and um, right. I mean, I said to people, say, the road is not our road. It's only because we are here. Why we go going to use the road? But other than that, it's not our road. The developers, them come in and them soon. Then St. Thomas burns just change radically. What about the water sources? Right. What about the water because sources in St. Thomas? Kind of what about the water sources? My brother, what about the water sources in St. Thomas? Well, what about the, traffic, again, traffic, traffic light? Traffic, traffic the light the cannot traffic, traffic light can't save nobody's life, you know. Well, yeah, I suppose that I, I suppose it can. But it's, water, water is life. What about the water sources in St. Thomas? What are they yeah, doing with the water sources? So much river can they have Portland and St. Thomas and we don't have no water. Well, th that's the point. So that's why St. Thomas people have a lead from where they are to protect the water sources because you have already lost a whole lot of it and you are about to lose more and you're losing more as I'm speaking to you right now because yes. those people yes. are developing St. Thomas in the way they develop St. Anne mm -hmm. and St. Mary and that development including taking away the water sources even the watershed has been sold yes i hear you talk about it partly every sunday you understand the yes. seriousness the yes. watershed we we know responsible for the watershed areas the swamps where the mangrove supposed to be they're dumping them up and building um up spanish hotel and this hotel and that yes, hotel that, that. where does that leave the people so this is the point the, the, the so point is that is, every this parish is the real shake up where we need we, we, we see the real shake up where we need so let me ask you a question you know you may call upon saint thomas people for what they say on the water yeah man we hear everything that we listen to you every Sunday. look at the water because it's St. Thomas, I am afraid. But I am saying that's what I am saying. I am saying to you and to, to everyone, we need a radical shake up, and everybody has to get involved. Else, it now got changed. Everybody must get involved with the change. I would that say no. To, I would to say me. I would say to the St. Thomas people this morning that if you live near water and you have lived near water, a long time you know go a river, but you used to go a long time you know go a beach, but you used to go. Walk and find out if you still have access to the water, to the beach, to the rivers, to the water sources. Look and find out what happened to your waterfalls. It's not global warming. It's not climate change. It's give them, give it to the private sector and to foreigners and then we turn on and tell us about climate we, change. We know that, Captain. We know that. So my that brother. We not be overemphasized. We know that. All right. So, so maybe. What we need is just a radical shake up. Everybody get involved, especially those that have big influence and can make the change happen. Is that me? I just that me. I say, you know. So, so we have to find out where we can begin from. We have begin with the UIC, and we know that the UIC have many plans and can make it work. But if grassroots people, influential people, everybody. Well, I'm calling upon the UIC to out in Saint Thomas. To represent, so any time, to represent. Any time call, you call me anytime I have any, but no, call me to speak on a political stage. No, I do not, not speak on political stages. But but political. but when you are, so you come and you make a big change with the ball over thing right. with with with, him, with what's, what's your name there, Professor <laughs> Verin Shepherd. 
Yes. Yes. And many others. And yes. the Carl Bogle Foundation and this. But who yes, and, and Stoney got and all of that. But so call me when you're ready. Big up to St. Thomas and yes, no banana deck. Yes, my brother. Give thanks. So, respect. Respect to you too. Yes. She is a Sunday, April 7th, 2024, and uh, we are on the eve of the total solar eclipse here on the island. We'll be uh, experiencing, we're told, partial eclipse, especially in the West, and um, then smaller parts, <laughs> smaller partial uh, in places like Sedan and so on. Hopefully we'll be able to catch a glimpse of it. Uh, Lots of things we have been saying about that all morning, but long and short of it is that we welcome this uh, celestial event for us. It is what it is. Uh, we know that there was one in 2017. We watched that also, went through similar processes. And we also know that there are some differences between, key differences, if you will, between the 2017 and uh, 2024. Well, well. Yes. So I am I am doing well myself. Exactly. There you go. Uh, this is this is Mansa. Yes, Mansa Odudua. Yes, Mansa Odudua. Yeah, my brother. <laughs> I have been listening, you know, um so that some from time to time I have been get caught in with everyday things. So I don't listen to you every Sunday, which I would love to. Mm -hmm. However, this morning um the spirit just called me and said, you know, it's time for you to listen to Sister Kabu this morning because mm -hmm. your contribution will be imperative to the conversation mm -hmm. with the solar eclipse because I am a spiritual person. Mm -hmm. I see it as a spiritual phenomenon. Mm -hmm. um, this, the physical side of me see that there's something happening to us in this physical time and space. Mm -hmm. So these things I don't even, I pay attention to them, but I just know that these things happen in our current and it will happen again from time to time. Yes. However, there are some things that I um, discussed uh, earlier that I would like to um, to touch on and just simply go through the, the go through some of the things. Then, um, curriculum in Jamaica, mm -hmm. the state of Jamaica. Um, but while I was in the state, I realized that the, the, the high school secondary thing, because I go secondary school, now I still on the step, mm -hmm. but I realized that they were changing the Ministry of Education was changing, you know, saying everything needs to be high school, you know. But with my primary level education that I had, formal education that I had, I thought that. The ones who in the position that had uh, got that knowledge, that academical um, enhancement, would realize that just changing the name would not make any difference. You know, I, where I was at the time, I was seeing that the government would look at JC, KC, Georges, Calabar, all of those schools that children would want to run to, and take those curriculum integrate them into, say, for instance, like a STEM program and spread it right across the island to all of these high school, not no name high school, because they're just still secondary school, but the high school them still have the same curriculum and people still run from Hanover, Wangwa, PC, and all of them things. You know, so I, I, I thought that it would have been something that they would well, have the, the, the question, Yeah, the question was, what was the mandate when they changed the name? <laughs> and and, and you're, you're making a great point. Changing the name, but not changing... The, the curriculum, the, the curriculum, mm -hmm. but us are not changing. Also, uh, or attempting to change the stigma that was already attached mm -hmm. to these schools. Because we still have these a lot of these the schools still have this stigma attached to them. If you notice, people still talk about traditional high school as opposed. Mm -hmm. to, look how many years after, and they are talking mm -hmm. about traditional high school as opposed to non-traditional high school. That's classism. So Jamaica's education system developed along the lines of classism. And it just it remains classes, and so they they separate children. If you notice, um, rich people pick no go no go um, non so called non traditional. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you understand what I'm saying? Okay, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. So let, let me elaborate a little bit more. So from from the curriculum, now we have lawlessness. So if it is like that, most of the the, the, the only people picking them. We go at them school there. When them do the crime, them are some big crime. Because if them are bringing gun a thousand versus like a poor man, I will get one like one gun. And everything that they do leads, the lawlessness leads to the ones who did not get that, that edu academical educational structure. Now, with that, I have to point to we, who we are as a people, yes. a nation. Yes. Now, if you, if you read the document that, that they call a constitution, 
you will recognize and now i'm telling you what you think of a primary ed- uh, um, academic education so ones who really get a better academic i would like them to do some of these research the, the document that we have stating that it's a constitution it's not a, it, it, it says jamaica in brackets no constitution in brackets say jamaica constitution in brackets order of 1962 so we actually have a Jamaica order of 1962 and then the true constitution in the first make it look pretty and get the get the, the state of Jamaica registered to become somewhat of a democracy. But it is not a democracy. One attorney t- told me that he said it's only a democracy on paper, but it's a, it's not a democracy in, in practice. Mm-hmm. No, when we look at the look at the whole thing, no, Sister Kabo. What, is, what, is, that, what is it in practice? What, um, repeat the question. What, what, what did the attorney say about what is it? It's not democracy. In it is a dictatorship. Okay. This is a dictatorship, but they just use the brackets, the constitution in brackets, just to, mm-hmm. just to sway the ones who would think that they are educated, but the ones who do not educate, they never even read the document. Mm-hmm. So I read the document. Yes. There is one thing into that document that gives us some kind of rights, and it is the chapter three, which is the fundamental rights and freedom. That is the only thing outside of that. Now it goes right down to chapter six. Now chapter six states that 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 that, that the, the executive power of Jamaica is vested in Her Majesty. Now Jamaica, now we have to look at Jamaica. Jamaica is a state, a registered state by the British monarch. So whosoever that say that they are a Jamaican, they are just accepting the fact that they are still a subject of the British monarch. Mm-hmm. Simple because if you look at the document again, that call a birth certificate. The one what we have here in, in, in uh, on this island, it does not say birth certificate. It yeah. says birth registration form. People go look at these things. Now, when I talk about it's not done, are you going to see the government around to change it and I put in birth certificate in it now? But on the document, it says birth registration form in the black, letter, black letters. Mm-hmm. So we actually are a registered entity to the British monarch. So the reason for that now is that they can give us anything and do whatever they want to do to us because we are just an entity into that registered corporation, Jamaica. Remember now, the island had a name before now. The island had a name. It's spelled X-A-Y-M-A-C-A. Can pronounce it as Jamaica or Examaica. That island still exists with the state of Jamaica that's owned by the British monarch. Now them guys, they know we get the education through that system there. That them saying go away UA and them see them brightness and them brilliantness and some of them are some wicked people too. So them just take these people and them educate them of how to manage this operation for the British monarch, which is JLP and PLP, whichever one the people who register to that corporation state that we, we would want you, Mark Golden, or Andrew Oldness, to be the person. Remember now, you know, even if the people vote in that person, they don't know the, 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 the um, name Governor General has to approve. So that simply means that even Andrew Wallace and Chanty want to talk about military on the street. It's not Andrew Wallace of military on the street. It's the Governor General with the British, with the British um, High Commission. They are the one who put in these military on the street to turn the state of Jamaica into a military state. Look at the police them out the road nowadays. All of the young police, they must see me, a 58 year old, and they must see me, one of them must see me, pull over, why pull over there? So I never talk to me like this, some kind of little, when the children, they're older than them. And you see, what they're doing is that they are using these intimidating tactics so the people can get sensitized that this is going to be a military run state, the state of Jamaica. Now, to the conclude on that note, to say, oh, we take charge of that note, Sister Kabo. Mm-hmm. They say that 70% of a no send a vote and not and a, and a take part. Mm-hmm. That 70% have to find out how they are going to make JLP and PMP, which is the Jamaica State Management Corporate Company, or we're going to make them null and void. Because now, Sister Kabo, the, the, the past, um, the previous caller who said, who call you and talk about you being in the politics. Not even recognizing that, yes, you are a journalist and it's poli- you will be talking about the politics, but you now go make the bad say nobody to be voted. No, but no, I'm, 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 I'm doing more than talking. My journalism is advocacy, no, but, but the, oh, the, 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 the point out, the, there's a point to yeah. be made, right, in, in terms of the 70%. Is that, you know, last last week, I think the, there was a demonstration at Little Dunn's River. Uh, because the government has locked down Little Duns River, locked the people out of it, and um, 
unless the people stand up, then you lose access to that. That is, but that's not just little Dunsibers, uh, almost all of Jamaica, where they're locking us out of, of, of access to the ocean. Now, there are demonstrations here and there. I remember there was one at um, Blue Lagoon uh, last year, and there was one at Bob Marley Beach two weeks ago and so on. Now, this is where the 70% comes in, you see. We have to make our, our presence felt. And Minosa is not just one solid homogenous um, you know, group. But when these calls are made, we need to carry our bodies to the spaces as best as we can to show them that we are serious. I know you need a critical mass. So we need a critical mass, not the same, same one every time, every time, every time. But we need a critical mass. What is happening in St. In St. Thomas, for example? We don't hear anything about St. Thomas. People soon start ball out because they're going to be wondering why they don't have no water, why they don't have no running water, why they don't have no pipe water. But all the condominiums and the, the high, high-end um, apartments and the hotels that are being built there have massive amount of water that the water dig up for lay a pipe for them and so on. St. Thomas people soon realize exactly what is about to hit them over their head because them right now they're down the street light and highway. So the point I'm making is that we ha- we are the ones that we've been waiting for. We have to put carry our bodies if need if possible to the spaces to make a loud shout, a loud voice. We have to carry our bodies to the Parliament of Jamaica. Um, I have been in Parliament many times sitting up at top because we were advocating for the change of something and the announcements were then made in Parliament and we were there to witness it, to be a witness. So uh, for me is how can you influence change? What can we do to influence a change that we want to see? First of all, we, first of all, we have to reimagine the kind of Jamaica that we want. Because if this are the kind of Jamaica we want, then we don't need to do nothing at all. Not even vote. My sister, Kabo, I sent you an email on the 16th of January. I would please ask you to check it out for me. And when you check it out... What is that email? It, 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 um, it is a uh, Mansa bio. Could you, resend, could you resend it for me, please? Because I, I, I normally respond I, to my email, and if I didn't respond to you, it means I didn't see it. As I speak, I will send it right yes. now as I just touch yes. it all and send it out. And I can explain a lot of these things because I've been through some things. And it's, um, I came to this, these things, Sister Kabu, based on the fact that when I leave to the States, when I leave to the States, I'll just give you a little brief thing. When I leave to the States in 1988, um, I recognized that it was an election in 1990. And then the, the, the American people pick up them, them thing and them gone about them business and it's, you know, business as usual and the Jamaicans them used to kill half themselves the virgin them from Waterhouse, Tower Hill, all them people, they did a New York and Washington Beach, all go over the place them and kill half themselves. So I stopped to say, why, what is the difference between the politics of Jamaica and the politics of the United States of, of America? And Sister Kabu is open up a whole different, it let me, it, it put me into the point where I read about 25 different constitutions across the globe. Let, so us talk, let, let us talk about it another time. Thank you so much. Oh, we, let okay, us look at sister. these two calls. But thank you so much please, for calling. Please, and please thank be you with you on the other. Give thanks. Down. All right. As we continue to take your telephone calls uh, inside of the program this morning, we're just about 15 minutes going up to 10 o'clock or 17 minutes. So we'll take about two more calls in between. Use it. What do you have in your hand? Use that. What can I do from where I am? We're going to have to stop looking for a hero. We'll have to stop looking for that one person. And know that that one person we're looking for is ourself. Let us be leaderful. Leaderfulness. How do I lead from where I am? And then we collaborate. So call me. Call uh, uh, um, uh, Devon Taylor. Call, you know, people who you know are active in certain, if, if it's a beach, you know, you're called Devon, right? If it's another kind of activism and advocacy, you know, you call Rosalie Hamilton or Donna Mattis and them and so on. But the, the, we reach out to each other. There has to be this shift in the paradigm where we sit down and wait on each other, wait on and one person to do everything. That is a recipe for failure. What is your responsibility? 
for change? What do I have in my hand? What do you have in your hand? Use it for change, for positive change. What can I do in my community for change? Are there children in my community? Are they going to infant school, basic school, kindergarten, which part, prep school? How, how do they need clothing? They need food, they need help with something once a week, once one, one, one day a week. Yeah, man, how are you doing? I'm well, how are you? I'm good. Let me talk to you one time before, once before, no? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I was driving up a while ago. I hear, I overheard a, 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 the, the last call, I think. Yes. Yeah. Um. Uh, you see, first time, I agree with that call. Like that. You see, first time I read the Constitution of Jamaica. Mm -hmm. I realized why they hid it from us. Because in America, you know, say, most citizens can tell them first amendment, second amendment, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. All right. When first time you read the Jamaican Constitution, I understand. You know that Michael Manley, not Michael, Norman Manley and Buster Manley was two first coming, right? Yes. All right, Buster changed his name. It's a form of disguise so, so that people don't really realize that they are two cousins or something like that, you know? Mm. All right, you know that Norman Manley fought in one of them World War for England, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, say so England sent it to one of them down here. I, I know yeah. I know that they are that, that they became um at some point puppets for the British government, yes? Yeah man, yeah. Um you know say the, the whole executive and the opposition when you read the constitution, the executive, the whole government structure is 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 owned by the, the crown, you know that? The yeah yeah because the, the, the head of state of Jamaica is the monarchy, the British monarchy. Yes, it and is, it's in the constitution. It states that the whole executive. Yes. The whole executive works the same manner. That meaning yes. meaning meaning Andrew is the prime minister. The, the whole opposition, the the, 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 the the judiciary. That's why when you go to court, you stand in the name of the king now. Yes. And that is why when you go to parliament, you pay, you pray for the king and him and him pick them. Yes. The so it's based on the constitution. It's called um, Crown Corporation. So what about Crown Land? There's Crown Land, Crown Corporation, Crown everything. I mean, they, 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 they head, they, the British monarchy is the head of state of Jamaica. It is, that means that a them can't a them rule the country. And it's interesting that we think that um, we have some kind of autonomy or some kind of independence. But 1962 was a trick. And we are still laboring under that misconception that we are yes. some of game. Yes, and, game and you know what? No, they might try to trick this one next six years. I see, I see, in Malahu Fort, they might try to come up with a, a, a we call it ceremonial president, and then just remove the governor general and just say that president was going to be a ceremonial president, and just, uh, just like the, 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 the governor general, and like Barbados have a. A ceremonial president. But that's we, what want to do. So the question then is, are we going to accept it? And this is why I keep talking about all those of us who decided, and, and it is really 70%, I know we talk about the 70%, but are we going to stand by and allow them to do what they were about to all do? Right. This is what we're going to do. Um, they trick our forefathers, our older father, my great grandmother, uh, my great grandfather, because they couldn't read as much as us. But most of us now we go to high school, go to university. So what we're going to do, you know, it's the, 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 the voter turn is getting lower. So what we, we must do, we must not support P and Pain, P A I N P and J A I L, J L P, meaning jail to the people and pain to the people. We must not support them anymore. We must form ourselves into independent candidates or new parties and vote for our people because Mark Wolin does not represent us, neither does Andrew Wolin represent us. They represent our slave masters who whipped us through, through the middle passage, who threw our, some of our fathers in the ocean, Atlantic Ocean. A lot of them died here, who died on the ship. 
So we let me, let me, let me answer a question. Can there yes. be, is, is, in terms of the, the constitution we're working with and in terms of just, just how we set up now, can there be any third or fourth party in Jamaica without that party, whoever, the, the leader who is chosen to be the prime minister, if them wins, let us say it's not the PNP or the GLP, without, um, without taking that oath of allegiance to the crown under the current constitution? Yeah, yeah, man, you're over to it now. Mm-hmm. Um, um, numbers is what we That's why I tell you the last time, Andrew and Mr. Mark will not worry about what you do. You're doing for many years. Mm-hmm. What they worry about is when the people start come together as one and move away from them. So if you notice know, the last election, they were putting out ads telling people how to vote because they get to find that people is not interested in voting for them anymore. So we have to form ourselves into groups and vote for us slave descendants from the state who does not agree with that fake slavery constitution. That's how we're gonna have change. That's the only way because PNP and JP was not set up to help the slaves. They were set up to help the private sector and the crown. Mm-hmm. So yeah so 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 it, so in other words you di- disregard constitution disregard what is current what currently is without any kind of constitution yes are you and, you are not strong woman you are mm-hmm. not strong woman mm-hmm. yeah, let's give you a year mm-hmm. look here people who are not and put in a constitution are empty but you can't free it you know it's you know right. you know i'll give you the name of one of my best friends mm-hmm. Antoinette Horton. Uh, yeah, yeah. She was so, she see? she was mm-hmm. she was she did, she was on air doing something similar and was told the very same thing. We had mm-hmm. many many conversations around that, and this is why I ask you about the current system, and if the system as it is uh, can uh, uh, tolerate an independent voice in within that system, and if the people will support that independent voice. The, the, the and secondly, want, and, secondly the want, and secondly, but the people have supported it more than them yes. the month because of what these things are. So so that, that's a whole other discussion though. But but I give you my friend, my darling sister, Anthony Horton. Thank mm. you so much for calling. Yeah man, never leave something with you before yes. you know. the P S O J Yes. They have a name. That they push forward to Jamaica being private sector organization of Jamaica. But they have a hidden name. The real name for PSOJ that they don't tell us is Privileged Sons of Jamaica. When it was started, that was the name. Privileged Sons of Jamaica. Are you serious? Are you just pulling my legs? No, I mean, I tell you the real name. <laughs> but they, 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 look here, what they push forward, you know, they, <laughs> have, they, have, they have a... They have have the real name they had the all the time. Yes. But they don't put that out. They are trivial <laughs> sons of Jamaica. That's what it means, dear. Well said, well said. Thank you for that. All right. All right. All right. All right.